Welcome to the novel ice stream. Who do we have today in our live chat? Live chat, probably just called chat. There we go, got the chat popped out. Let's see who we have today. We got Kaylin. Kaylin, good to see you, man. As always, thank you so much for being here. Welcome to the stream. Nadron, thank you as well for being here today. Welcome. Oh, which reminds me, I should boot up the game. Uh, exit lag. I had a comment on my one of my YouTube videos today where he was like, you don't need to VPN anymore. It's my friend Dvalin. <laughs> oh, I appreciate it, Kayla. My friend Kaylin. I, I had a weird comment on my YouTube video today that he was saying that you don't need to VPN anymore to play in Korean server, that you purely mm. just need to buy the account in Korean, that's everything. And I was like, is that real? I haven't tested it yet, but I'm a bit curious now. I had to click on my Steam Deck that I'm live on TikTok as well. Can I? Is the, is the sound working? That I'm live on TikTok as well. It's working. Cool. Um, start game. I'm still booting up the game. Booting up the game. Disable the background video. Yep. Enter game. So, uh, Naturon and Kaylin, how has your day been? Are you alright? I totally forgot to ask before. <laughs> I hope you're both doing okay, man. Natron, good bro, I'm on shift today as a remote. Oh, so as a remote, like you're working from home, like remote work, or how does that work? Uh, 
refresh, refresh, refresh. Pause. Pause. There we go. Pop out chat. Ah, uh, Kaden, I had a bad day, but it's getting better slowly. Ah. Huh. I'm sorry to hear that, Kaden. Like, um... Something you want to share here, or should we just, um... Forget all about it and continue life, or is it something you would like to share? There we go. Look how pretty this game is. All right, um, Anod, welcome to the stream, man. Good to see you, man. Hope you're doing okay. Welcome. Uh, natural, like a night watcher. If something is happening on server sites, they should be able to reach me. Just that I'm at home. Oh, okay, okay. So you, okay. I see. So you basically can do whatever you want, like play games, uh, you know, whatever you want, but you still have to like be ready to pick the phone. Kind of like um, when people work as firefighters remote, then they also have to pick up the phone if the if some fire kind of like fire comes. Welcome to the stream, Silo. Good to see you, man. Good to see you, Silo. Welcome to the stream. Hey, then just insecurities about my work. It'll pass. Oh. Sorry to hear, Kayla, man. Um, yeah, I hope as you say, it will pass. Or else you know me, I'm always up for a chat on uh, Discord if anything needs. Natural, exactly. Yep, yeah, yeah, yeah. So what is your guild name? I would like to join. You are more than welcome to join. It's called Grayskull Bros. This. Oh, this up here. You can instant... Um, instant... Join. See you any bosses today? I was thinking uh, probably doing that level 20 dungeon, maybe, perhaps. Um, my first goal today is that I would, land, I would like to level a bit because I'm so close. Oh my god! Yes, I had that. I have the quest here. I stopped the mana frenzy. And that it's actually coming today at um, 10. So I'm definitely gonna go on that one. Nice, thanks. I joined. Oh, cool, man. Cool, 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 cool. You will definitely have to join on uh, some bosses or dungeons. Ah, oh, nice. Barn TV he has acquired rank 7. So we all got a box. And not nice fangs I joined. If you need a DPS, let me know. I'll definitely. Thanks to Alan. I was invited. <laughs> no worries. Um so the first thing actually the only actually the only thing I can do is do um contracts I'm over here. I need to get to level 45 so I can like, follow my um So I can continue my main quest, but for some reason I can't because, you know, I need to be level 45, so I need to do some uh, co contracts. But uh, yes, Hilo, I will let you know uh, whenever we start. Grelago, welcome to the stream, good to see you, man. Hey, how do you play um, Throne of Liberty? Um, so I actually got a guide. 
I got a guy. Silo, are you sure? Because I, I see a lot of people saying the other side of what you say. I see a lot of people saying, you know, um, that contracts give more XP than low quests. But Gulago, I got a guide there for you. Basically, you need exit like VPN, then you need to go to G2G to buy an account for like something like $5 or something. And then, yeah, you need to use the VPN to play. Kind of like Lost Ark back in the days. Though with Lost Ark, I think you could create a card and an account without having to buy it. So that one actually, that was actually easier. So this one here gives 40,000 quest. Fourteen thousand. Can you see how much XP these gives? Thirty-two, sixteen, sixty-six, seventeen, eighty-eight. Ah, uh, that's 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 not that's a lot of that's a lot of XP. Defeat Starlight Firefly at night. Okay, Silos, I think we're gonna do um I think we're gonna do what you're saying. God damn it, I hate this. Like does this mean that I'm taking the quest or not? There we go. And the one that gave me insane amount of XP is this one here. Defeat Starlight Firefly at night. Which is called Danger Within Peace. Defeat Starlight Firefly at night. Add 49 daily quests are worth it. Because you're getting in-game rewards. I see. Does anyone know where these fireflies are? Oh, okay. It actually showed them here. They are round over here. Okay. So we gotta go down there while it's night. I mean, it's pretty lucky. It's night right now. Oh no, what, what is this? What is that mess message? Are you gonna get a maintenance again? You're gonna be kidding me. Uh, translate image. Images. Due to unintimidated patch on the 14, an issue was unblocked users in the block during an in-game purple chat being fixed. We would like to inform you that chat blocking stages are cured before the modification. The client uh, is updated through reconnecting so you can directly block the user who is experiencing the problem and then unblock again to use the chat normally. Okay, so no maintenance. It's basically just some kind of like... Um, Something that you can block people in chat if they do something, I don't know. I don't know. Okay, so um, I remember we tried to do this one here last time on stream, but failed too much. So I'm going to try today. I think it's somewhere up there in the ship, but let's see.
Wait, what? There's nothing up here, but that guy there down there has like a mark on him. Oh, so the last one you could first do at night. Okay, Kaelin, remember that. I didn't finish that quiz, can't find it all. Look at this, Silo. This guy here only comes at night. He, he wasn't here at, at days. So because it's a night, he was here. I was trying to do... I mean, I was just really trying to find that guy. But now it makes sense why I couldn't find him, because he's a ghost that only comes at night. Um, uh, I need to do to that too. Yeah, I, just, I actually saw you, Kalen. I saw you. Uh, I didn't finish that quite some more. Jude, welcome to the Jude Drive. Well, I'll call you Jude. Uh, mobile game? No, it's not a mobile game. Not a mobile game. It's a it's a PC console, like PC, PlayStation, and um, Xbox. Judge oh. even beat just followed. <laughs> Appreciate the follow, man, and welcome to the stream. But it's not a it's not a mobile game. Not a mobile game. It's not a mobile game. Screw up the chat bot, so I need to remove it. Don't, don't do that. Oh shit! Oh, what am I doing? Don't put on shield mode. Me gas. Yeah, we're we just just banning you. There we go. He's banned. Goodbye. Thanks for the follow, Khaled. Khaled underscore 72, Khaled underscore 72, Khaled just followed. Welcome You're to the wizard, street. Harry. You are a wizard. Oh, wait, by the way, I saw no, uh, I saw some new people redeeming points. Mm -mm -mm -mm. By the way, is the chat back to normal? I, I misclicked on that shield mode. Mod icon, show moderation actions, boom, boom, boom. I think the chat is back to normal. We just had to ban that guy. That makes sense now. You are a wizard, Harry. But again, Khaled, thank you so much for the follow, man. Appreciate it. Welcome to the stream. Didn't I see Neek also? Uh, yeah, Neek, there you go. Using Headless Horseman. Good to see you, man. Should be back to normal, yeah. Do you also play uh, Front Liberty, Keller? But uh, that other guy before, he just wanted to, you know, he just wanted to make me banned with making my, um, my, uh, what is it called? Sound to, sound to speak, saying bad words. 
Nick, hey, good to see you too. Hope you had a good day. I mean, it's not that late in your time zone, but you know, still. What is this? Collect one collection to power a king at Delico. Hmm. Pock. Hello, the first descendant. Good to see you, aka Saga. How are you doing today? Does anyone know what how I get this one here? Collection to power King Adeli Co. Uh, use the measuring device and get the southern rocky and get to the southern rocky isle in twenty five seconds. Oh, hello, Kayla. Good to see you. You're a wizard, Kayla. Read books on beach. Read books on beach. Hey, old Bumby, good to see you, man. Welcome to the stream. The measuring device is on the top of the tower. Yeah, I, I remember that one. I just had to like find out which island it's talking about. Um, but those books you're talking about, what are those? Oh, is that like the oh the purple ones? The ones that you just randomly find find around the world. So I have to measure this and then get what it was it? Sadumo Island, the one over there on the other side. And get to the Southern Rocky Isle. PP today? No, probably not, since we still haven't reached max level yet. Um, yes, and it's the small green island, it's not on the map. Oh, so it's just that little one there. That one? Awesome. Appreciate it. Damn. Nice. Hey, did I just get a new morph? Oh my god, I got a... What a swain. Oh, I got a swain. Look at that. No more eagle time, now it's swainy time. <laughs> That's funny. Bro, don't spend time with daddy emo. Come, we can do contractors fastly. No, I I, I, I kind of want to, I kind of want to do these since I, I get what you mean. I get what you mean. But I kind of want to do these because they give like fun rewards. And look at this. That one I just did before gave me 88k XP. That's the same as uh, six contracts. Like, bro, that's a lot of XP. So I'm just going to finish these since they give what a lot of XP. I'm a swain. But I appreciate the invite to run. Well, I'm just gonna do do these because it's kind of fun. It is fun. So, uh, Kaylin, do you know exactly where the Pirate King book is? Oh, I have to go up there again. Or is it just like random which book I'm... Actually, I don't think I've drank up my coffee yet. And now it's of course half cold. <laughs> By the way, I wanted to ask um, in chat 
if anyone has played Helldivers 2, is it worth it? I was really thinking about streaming it today. Um, but like, has, has anyone played it? Is it worth it? Kumon with a small mental tree at daybreak. Collect the power and her life. Okay, and I'm not sure where all the books are, but I know that you need them for the quest. I see, I see. The first descendant, yes, it's worth it. The best one, if you love democracy, you'll love it. Yeah, I, I saw some funny clips with people literally saying we're bringing democracy, uh, democracy to like the entire world. I'm just like wondering like how long time you can play it without it gets because I feel like I've played a lot of games like that where you know they, they get a bit bored after five ten maps matches and stuff like that but it also looks like a game you can just keep grinding and have a good time and keep upgrading your character but the main reason I didn't do it today was because I wanted this character up in max level can't just leave, you know, in the middle of a... of a grind. Oh shit, we have to be up there? I mean, nothing is down here, so I, it, it has to be up there. Play with friends, it never gets unfun. I see. Well, I probably will buy it no matter what. I'm probably going to buy it 100%. Um, it's another race tree. Oh, so you have to like run. to grapple up oh it's like my time is that has it like run out do i have to like restart it okay so i have to grapple up i see uh it's ace man just got a g to g account and exit like vpn and got stuck at the number and can't get a korean number gg wait what it's Ace Man, so when you buy the account, you're supposed to be allowed to change your email, your phone number, and your password as the first thing. Um, and when you change the phone number, they give you like a link, like a website link, uh, which you have to open. And then when you request for the code, the code is going to send to that link. See, the UK numbers doesn't work for me. That's weird. Hey, Eridev, good to see you.
Hold on, I'm gonna look in the chat in two seconds. Oh, how the hell do I get up there? <laughs> if I click on this tree again, is it gonna start another race? Wow, these these blue quests give insane amount of experience points. I'm just saying it like I just went from there or to there in like minutes. I see now. You missed that you get a new guardian? Oh, really? Lady Knight Kamashia. Create a shield for 50% of your max mana. Cooldown speed 40% up. While the shield is up, someone ends. While the shield up, someone ends when the shield is removed. That's pretty wild. So in all that time she's active, you your cooldowns are like insanely fast reloaded. I like that. I like that. Alright, I'm gonna read the chat again in 40 seconds, because it says right now people are having ads. You know, people who are not subbed. It's Ace Man, thank you so much for the follow, man, for sure. What is the chat saying? You can. It's Ace Man just followed. It's Ace Man. So I got I got the account and went to sign in with the email and password. Then it asked me in the purple app for inside a Korean number. That's well. Did did you remember to go to the website and change your f phone number from the Korean number to your own number? Like, did, did you do that? Because you need to use the link to change the Korean number to the to your own number. And in that email, the, the, in, in the message the guy gave you, it should have had like, you know, some kind of uh, thing where you could get the code. Hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. I have the link here. When you log into the website, it's, you know, the website itself, uh, the NC soft website, you can change your mobile number here, this link. This is very important that you change your phone through that link, you change your email through that link, and you change your password through this link. If the person who, if the person you bought it from didn't send you this in the, like, Ch try on G2G, check your message because they usually send this stuff in your chat message. If they send, they didn't send you this, it sounds like a bad buyer, seller. Because the one I saw, saw, bought it from gave me all these things. And you might have to buy it from the person I bought it from then. Yeah, no worries, man, and thanks for the follow, appreciate it. Uh, the first is that once we get an announcement, Dave or TL, we're gonna lean heavy into it. Yeah. I really hope that we're gonna hear something soon from this game. Because, you know, I'm, I'm gonna get to end game grind now, which is cool and all that, don't get me wrong. But it would be cooler to do the big heavy end game grind on 
a Europe server instead of a Korean server. Was it, what, what, what is it we have to do over here? Examine something. I guess I have to get up there. Oh, so I need to have it open in the background. I see. Are you actually able to see the song name I have up here? Or is it like very, 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 very small? I can read. Okay, cool. Cool, 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 cool. Appreciate it, man. I just thought it was funny to like sh show what music I was listening to. Wait. What is this? Rotate the shuttle to solve Juniper's problem? Yeah, I can. Um, can you contact me on Discord? Because uh, then I'm going to send it to you. I just don't want to send it here since I don't have any, like, I don't have any, like, dealership with them. So, you know, I don't want to, like, uh, buy it from this person. So this person here, I'm gonna send you now. When you buy from that person, they send you all the links and everything you have to do in direct message. Maybe they are also a bit more expensive, but you can see they have 100% upvote and they, they give you like everything. I hope you don't say now that this is the same person you already bought from. But this one here is really, really good. And very important you read their message because they have the link and that um, uh, the code there which you get the phone number so when you you know write in the phone number they gave you so what am i supposed to do here rotate the shadows to solve the universe problem kaylin i need your spoils what did you do here loud Turn it into a unicorn. Oh, and Bradley, Brad, Bradlix, thank you so much for joining the stream. Good to see you, man. First time streamer. Uh, first time, first time chatter. Welcome to the stream, man. Okay. 
Okay, turn it into a unicorn. Okay. Be a Fordoxy just followed. But I imagine you need a full. Okay, it has wings now. Now we just need the horn. I mean, that could also work. Isn't it like, I mean, it has a horn, it has a wings. Are you not entertained? Like, come on, I, I mean, that was, that's pretty good. But I guess it's not happy with it, like, hmm. Turn wings. Oh. Ah. Uh, appreciate it, man. Appreciate it. I assume you are max level since you know all this. Good yeah, max level done it all. Ah, oh, nice. Oh, hey, hey, bro, in um, YouTube chat. Uh, can I play this game? Well, you can, but it requires some work. It, it actually requires a lot of work. Um, you have to follow this guide here I have on YouTube. Basically, you need to buy an account. You need to buy a VPN. That's a lot of things you have to do. But if you have the patience, you can just wait. Just wait till it releases in... A few months. Uh -huh. <laughs> I already failed. Okay, okay, let's let's try let's try and look at that. Uh orange it, it, it goes too fast. The way I done this was number the colors. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. I guess I need an Excel sheet. Confirmed few months. No, I mean, it's just, you know, because everyone is saying we're probably going to get this in Q3 and, you know, it's still a month away. Hold on, I'm going to open up my Excel spreadsheet. Uh, do I really have the login for that? Excel, okay. So red, orange, yellow, teal, blue, black, purple. Wait, what what the hell? How am I supposed to see that? We're we gonna do something else. We, okay, we're we gonna cheat now. I don't care, we cheat. We're gonna cheat. I'm gonna click record. I'm gonna say challenge. Uh, 
There we go. Gonna take that video clip. I know, I, I know it's really unfair, but you know, life is Record. unfair. <laughs> that works too. <laughs> exactly. Okay, so um, I'm gonna say challenge. Orange first. Blue. Uh, purple. Wait, what? So it, well, oh wait, oh it changes it. Wait, does it change every time? No, it should not. It should be the same. Challenge. Boom. Boom. Yeah, wait, wait, wait. That was different. Oh god, I saw it. It's not even the same every time. Okay. Ah. Record. Stop record. Find the record. Record. Okay, orange. Oh, I see. And the next one is, is that C, which is... That doesn't make sense. That That's this one here. That one is orange and it's a blue color. It seems you have something to do with the music of the statues. Okay. That one is the one that looks like a H, which is this one here. And when it plays, it looks very dark, like teal dark. Hmm. Wait, wait, I actually think it is the same every time. It is. So orange. Blue, dark, great. Yellow, orange, blue, per. like the colors doesn't even have anything to do with it it shows a per it shows a yellow as the number four orange blue black
Aha, this is the green one. I see, okay. Okay. So, orange, blue. Like, no. Oh no, why did you do that? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Boom. Orange, blue, black, green, yellow. Okay, that's the yellow one. Oh, what was that one, the, the last one? Okay, okay. <laughs> Just got the account and message and now waiting to get account info and link. Nice, 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 nice. Just got the account and message. Now waiting to get the account info and links. Adjusting Golem's hay to solve Juniper and Odin's problem? Can't, you, you can't be serious. And, and but it it doesn't even make sense like if they had like different colors or something like that but this is just like That's not gonna... Wait, what? That did something totally different then. I'm, ju I'm just saying it. I hate something like... I hate stuff like this. I... Hate it. Yeah, I mean, they, uh, they they have three different options. Every time you click on them, three different things can happen. See, this guy is now perfect. If there was some way I could like lock him, this guy is perfect. Is this even worth this quest? Like, am I getting like enough XP 
to care about it. Oh, it's not good. Just that that guy there, bro. Just get the hell up. No, sit down. No, you're ruining it. You're ruining it. You are ruining it. Okay. Okay. So that one is not going to work for me anymore. Hmm. That just totally, totally destroyed everything. Okay, so these two are mm -mm, never touched them. Let's see what the third one. Okay, so this is good now. So maybe mm, let's try again and see what happens if I click it one on one more time. Okay, then they do something really bad. Like really bad. Okay, so now I know the middle one is gonna make that one up and down, I believe. This one is making them both go up. I don't want this one to go up. Uh... Ah. Red legs, like, what, what, what would happen if I banned on this? Like, would, would that? Ah, <laughs> oh, th this is just a head edge. Like, I'm wasting so much time here. Are you for real? Like, uh, are you just playing around with me right now? Now these are perfect, and that one, and now this guy is like, gonna ruin your, your life no stop doing that see low hero of the catapult is easy xp and can be done so the part where you have to operate the catapult have another person active it for you to make it easier but it's doable in solo you just have to get the catapult quickly two five six four three one three two but this is not the catapult. Is it the next one? Oh my god. Why can't you just be aligned? At least if it has some kind of like, you know, turning so you could see which way. Like, this quest is really bad design. I'm just saying it. Because at least if it has some kind of like, you know, saying, uh, you know, this one is now in level one, two, three, like it, it doesn't show which gear I am on right now. 
four, five, two, three, three, five. What does that mean? Like, did I have to go to number four first? So the question is, which one is number four? Is that number four? Is that number four? One, two, three, four. But the problem is, like, now I have messed it up totally. I need to, like, reset them. Four. Five. Two. Three. Yeah, see, this is the issue. I've already messed them up way too much. So when I'm doing this now, it's... Um, it's it's messing it even more up. Is there a way to reset? Hello, can I reset? Make it reset. It's not going to let me reset. Uh, Silo has sent an image. But like when you when you click on them, they don't change like how they look. Do they? Yeah, but I'm I'm looking at the picture you sent me on this call, but it doesn't make what it. Why would they have to stand like that? What trip like down mid up down mid? Isn't it supposed to be like a bridge? Like isn't they supposed to like be like aligned? Hey Cox, Cox J. This one is a is a pain on the ass. It is like I I am uh, I I don't know. It it's annoying me more than it should. And welcome to the stream, by the way. First time chat. I appreciate it, man. It is way more annoying it than it should. At least I can set a combination now by Silo on how I should do it, but I, I, I can't even reset it. There's no reset button to like start from scratch.
see, get it closer and jump to die. I just need to get this guy down. You mean like find a place where I can jump out from and just die? There's a hook on the giants. Oh, hold on, hold two seconds. I'm pretty close now. No, screw this. Where you see this hook? Is this the first one or is this the last one? I sadly don't see any hooks. I've tried them all now. Is there like some place I can find where I can kill myself? That sounds really weird to say, but like... It's not activated yet, I guess you have to solve the puzzle before or after. Hmm. Yeah, but the thing is like I just wish there was like some kind of way where I could reset it. Yeah, but then I have to reset the entire puzzle, then I have to do the music one as well. That's what I'm trying to avoid. Screw this. I'm giving up. Giving up. I am, I think, one monster from level 45. Then I can follow up next my main quest. Kill one mob, then I'm going level. Literally one mob. There we go, thank you. Oh, I have to keep an eye on the what time because um, when it's uh, 22, I need to go to this mana event. Um, it's Ace Man, you keep up on Ashes of Creation? I used to, but I feel like, you know, um, 
I feel like it's one of those games where it's first gonna come out in like two, three, four, five years. I don't know. Um, so I've kind of stopped following it till we actually know like it's gonna come out in a half year or something like that. I feel like that's a way too long time till it comes out. I mean, like we we don't know. Like still, it looks like an alpha game. There's so many things that's missing. So. So it's, and and there's so many things that could change all the time in the game. So I feel like it's too early to begin to like, yeah, too much about it right now. When it comes out, trust me, I'm gonna play it. I'm gonna try it, and you know, looks very promising. But um, yeah. Seems like there's a long way again. So where are we going? Hello there. Talon. Speak with R to a Talon. Hey, Penny sent me. It's kind of like Arthur and uh, Merlin. Uh, Crooks is saying, on, on that room you can see it, probably the next weapon to be released. So you talk about like these? Because we have bows, we have wands, we have daggers, we have axes. No, we don't have axes. We have swords, we have shields, whatever the hell that is. I guess it's these, which is, uh, I guess that's a pole arm. Um, but that's also very like, um, like a lot of Korean games has pole arms. I remember always these like, um, yeah, pole arms and axes. Oh, can you imagine some kind of like two hand axe? Like a huge two hand axe? Ah, my good friend, welcome to the stream. Hey there, bro. When is, where is a video about Cold Punk News? <laughs> I'll, I'll make it on, um, I'll make it on um, Monday. I'll I'll make it on Monday. The Korpong video. Because I haven't had time this weekend to make the video. Uh, I only have the time to stream now. So yeah, it'll be Monday. And you know, again, the delay the game is going to get is like in a very long time. So we got plenty of time. Uh, it says, man, what role do you like to play? It's actually random. Like sometimes I like to play healer, sometimes tank, sometimes DPS. But if I can play like a role, which is like a bit of a mix of something, that would be like perfect. Like um, what I'm doing right now with this two hand sword and this wand is kind of like, you know, I deal a lot of damage, but I also heal the party, which I really think is cool. Like, you know, I can heal, help the healers if something goes wrong. Um, I can do good damage. You know, I, I like this one, even though a lot of people is going to look at it and be like, what is he doing? Like, is he serious? <laughs> but I, I just enjoy it. It's really cool with like some kind of like supportive role, but not healer. Yeah. 
A lot of people probably gonna think like that's real weird. Uh, yeah, two months. Yeah, that's the thing. Like that's a long time. What? Speak with. Okay. So we're gonna pretend we orcs. Tell Sarak what the orc said. Unholy, welcome to the stream, good to see you. Oh, uh, Cooks is saying, what's your thought on TL so far? So far, I, I think it's a really cool game. Um, it's like I like the weapons of this game. I like the spell system, the tap targeting system, the combat, the dungeon so far I've played is fun. I'm just having a hard time seeing what the end game is going to be like. You know, we grind dungeons, we get upgraded our gear, we do the guild raids where we kill bosses. Um, what is the next thing like? I'm just trying to imagine what you know. The full end game looks like, um, but so far I'm having a blast with the game. Okay, so that one, the shaman, actually sees. Basically, end game is dungeon upcoming, 30 man raid fight, and for castle every two weeks. And I think that's like okay with me. That would that would be okay with me. And and also, you know, they said they're working on raids right now. You know, sorry, not raids. Um, that's actually really cool, 30 man raids. Uh, but they said they're working on, you know, the arena system. And I'm, I'm looking really forward to that arena system. Especially, you know, because they said it's gonna be like 2 versus 2, 3 versus 3, 6 versus 6. Ah, bro, come on. Oh wait, can I get that here? Don't forget we're talking about the vanilla version of the game. Exactly. The same with World of Warcraft, you know. Uh, that game at the start also had like so little in-game. And this game could build on so many things. Can you make me stealth again? Okay, no. Hmm. But yeah, I... I when WoW launched, it didn't have much content released. Exactly. WoW didn't even have battlegrounds from day one. It basically just had dungeons and... Dungeons. <laughs> Still haven't heard from this seller. Try double... Like, try double your check, check, check your message thing. Or maybe you have to, like, go into settings on your account and click enable messages from everyone. I know I did that. Or just press, you know, contact them and basically you could just contact them and say, hey, what's up? Hey, Max, I hate that I need to use VPN to play this. I have about plus 200 MS. Oh, really? I have like 160. I actually think 140 right now. But of course, it depends on where in the world you are. Bro, welcome to the stream. Hello, so only Guildmaster and Visor can complete guild quests. Uh, uh, thank you so much for the follow on Twitch, man. I appreciate it. Guild quest. 
crap video games just followed. I'm pretty sure they just, you know, auto-complete. You don't have to, like, complete them manually. You're a wizard, Harry. Yeah, a uh, wizard, Harry. I'm pretty sure these, uh, these, you know, automatically completes. If that's what you're talking about. Yeah, yeah, you just, the only thing I can do is I can change them. I am the only one who has the power to actually change it. So I can change them, but everyone like you can see down here when they complete, you can see who they automatically get completed. Uh, you don't need to be pinned by it. It helps to ping, but it doesn't. They no longer ban accounts that not connect to. I just remember, you know, without the VPN, um, you would get like instant disconnected. Have they changed that so you don't get the instant disconnected again? Because I helped one recently, like we talking five days ago, and his VPN and all that wasn't set up correctly. So when he logged in, he got like um, disconnected. I hate that. I mean, uh, even though I have a one gig, uh, gigabyte fiber network, yeah, that, I have that as well. But you know, because it's latency, it depends on like how close you also are to the server. Um, without VPN, you can't open the game. For example, if you're in the US, Max, and I'm in Denmark, I am. I'm pretty sure I'm theoretically closer than you, server-wise. It says this region not support or something. Not many people like it, but a 100% game to be played with a group of friends skill. If someone is solo player, this is not the kind of MO. No, I mean, you can still play this game solo, but it's not going to be like... It's not going to be the best game for them. You'll all make friends and... Yeah, I, I mean, that's the thing, like, with this game here, you can always, like, uh... You can always, like, find people to play with. Join a guild. But again, if you don't want that, if you purely want to play solo... Then maybe... I, I don't know, maybe MMOs are not... Best decision then. I mean, solo like a video. Ah, uh, okay. I'm just excited for when we actually get some um, instant based PvP. Like, you know, a battleground you can queue out to arena or something. Like a battleground, like a 10 versus 10 battleground would capture the flag or like Aris Abbas and World of Warcraft with base that you have to conquer. That would be my favorite thing. Like I would love that. Open world PP and all that is fine too, but it's so guild dominated with the biggest skills and strongest skills. Um Someone saw Unhold it, let's be real, no MMOs are played solo, even if same. So ultimately we group with our players for content. Yeah, and then the, it requires the game have some kind of like mechanic where it can like queue you up for some, you know, like content. You know what I mean? Like it has to have some kind of like group find or something. Crox is saying Guild Wars skill capture point will be released soon. You can do it now, but it's search with search. Yeah, and I didn't they also say they're going to release that thing, you know, every time you go down in those um, dungeons at night, you know, the episode dungeons, then it will automatically throw you on a team, an alliance instead of guild. So it's not going to be guild versus guild anymore. It's going to be alliance versus alliance. And you just assign to another a random one. Don't know the name, but you can see the capture point on the map. No, no, that's a different thing. I just swear, like I swear I read that these episode, episode things, you know, these um, these dungeons here, Silas Abyss, Temple of Silver, these public dungeons, when they become night, I swear I read that it's not going to be guild versus guild anymore, but it's going to be alliance versus alliance, which 
you would get assigned to random. Uh, Max is saying I'm in Northern Europe. Okay, then we are probably from the same place. I found this game because I was curious if there is a lineage free. And this was in the top one Google result. So Max, this game was actually supposed to be lineage free, but it's the same developers, but they renamed the game. They didn't want it to be called lineage free. They wanted it as a new IP, but it's basically, there's a lot of things from lineage two in this game. Cox is saying, no, it's open world dungeons. The dungeon closes when it's night. So every, everyone that's inside can fight. If you die, you respawn outside and inside respawn buses. So it actually closes. But what was that thing I read then? Where you get like a signed uh, automatic like a uh, group alliance thing. Sushi, thank you so much for the follow man, appreciate it. Welcome to the stream. Thanks for the follow. Sushi 69 just followed. Robert, greetings from Swan Swansea. Swansea. What's that? Where's that? Welcome to the stream, Robert. Swansea. Oh, that, is that UK? Wales? Yeah, I just found you now on the map. You're looking, you're looking pretty close to something Cox called Mumbles. Just followed. You naughty naughty, you teasing me, you naughty naughty. <laughs> oh wait, who was... Oh, Cox, thank you so much for following as well, I appreciate it. Uh, that's for capture points outside the dungeons. After you finish this mission, you can check. There's different points on the map that you can capture a skill. But those, okay, so those capture points, I have seen them. It's like a big flag outside in the world. So those are going to be alliance based now and not guild anymore. But when is that coming? Because I know it's not yet here, right? But, uh, Robert, well, welcome to the stream. Good to see you, man. Cox and Sashi, thank you for, uh, thank you for the follow. So she's saying th this game has new world wipes. I mean, it it surely has. I mean, it has the weapon system, kind of like New World had. It has a very pretty world, uh, open world PvP stuff like that. So yeah, I, I I guess we could say you know it has the New World vibe, and it's also gonna get published by Amazon, not developed by Amazon, but published. Small Gunner did Throne of Liberty release in the West, or is this Korea? This is Korea. And welcome to the stream, man. Good to see you. How do I get over there? That Merlin guy, he's not very helpful. Oh, Bambi, you naughty naughty. Yep, now they are search versus search. They will change it for guild. Now they are search versus search. They will change it for guild versus guild. So instead of 200 versus 200 fight, it's going to be something like 50 versus 50. But that's not, that's, that's not, I think what I was reading. Like I was reading something where you would automatically get assigned an alliance when you go into that area, and then it would automatically pop you into a group, which you would automatically get assigned so you could fight with a team. Oh, that's for PvP events. Okay, yeah, because that's what I read. Something that would allow everyone to just go there, get assigned to a team automatically, and have fun. Bring collective to Sarek. I don't want to die. I don't want to die.
uh, because of this latency lag, it didn't get it. It's not because I'm bad, it's because of latency. Uh, now it is uh, it's, uh, like lineage and new world mash together. 100% sushi that is that is that is a good that is a good description lineage and they will smash together like a mashed potato yep small thing interesting so it support a full english client any time not on when we could expect it in europe in a so yes the entire game has english except the voice lines so every time an npc talk to you or something reads up it's in korean which Amazon is right now doing translation for, you know, they are getting in all the famous voice actors and, you know, translate the voicing. The game is expected, expected to come out in Q3. So Q3, you know, nothing official from Amazon. It's just whatever we have heard from all different inside knowledge that it seems like it's something that could come out in Q3. I don't know, it says right now people have an ad, but I'm not really sure if people has an ad. Uh, Robert is saying, always been a fan of NC soft games, but it seems that all the ones I like really get shut down, like Wildstar and City of Heroes. I, pl I played both of those as well. Um, Wildstar and City of Heroes, and I actually enjoyed both of them. But I'm glad to hear we both have played them. You know, NC soft is also owning... Um, they also own uh, uh, Guild Wars 2. So Guild Wars 2 is developed by ArenaNet, but Guild Wars, but the, who owns them, like who is their leaders, if you could say that, it's that's NZSoft. Uh, oh, that's for PvP events. Okay, see, 50 today or what? I hope 50 today. I mean, now we got main quests, but let, let's see how fast it, it's gonna go. I won't promise anything. Uh, still a half hour until the next event, which is gonna complete one of my quests. Sushi Amazon's been slacking. We need global release. I can't play a lot with 200 MS. No, I know what you mean. Like Amazon, they really need to like, they need, they just have to come with an update, like saying, how far are we? Like, are we far away? Are we a month away? Are we two months away? I just, I just feel like, you know, they have to say something. Give us some kind of like information. Cox is saying you were talking about castle fight or PvP events. I I I I don't know. I was just I was just Cox, I was just like reading the translated patch notes saying something. This event will now be turned into alliance event where everyone gets automatically assigned an alliance. And then I saw a lot of guilds on Reddit being like, oh, this is unfair now. It's not a content for only us. Now everyone can have fun and not only us like yeah, that's the point, that everyone can have fun, and not only you. <laughs> it takes, man, I kept getting errors when I went sign into my account, so I need to wait. Okay, that sounds bad. NC, NC South does a good job with MMOs. I was about to say, well, I mean, they did a good job with it, Guild Wars and Guild Wars 2, but that's not them, so. Okay, well, Guild what would they, yeah, they have quite a lot of many. I, I played all of them. I wish they didn't close um, Wildstar. Koreans in general are good with MMOs. Yeah, as long as they don't get, you know, when 
we get them in here in Europe in Ada, they they don't put too much like paid when inside them. Because I know the Korean ma audience, they like that. Um, that you can use your money in the game to get way stronger. Because some of them have even complained about this game doesn't have enough. It's kind of the theirs. I know in China, I think NCSoft is publishing and even doing stuff themselves with Guild Wars 2. It's kind of a bit different, the game over there. It says, man, yeah, from the seller you sent me, I don't know what's going on, but I'm hoping to get back to me soon. Did you write to them? Like, did you actually click contact them to write to them and just say, hey, what's up? What's your thought on pay to win? I would like to know now that you don't know much about... I would like to know now that you don't know much about the game. Well, I don't... I don't seem to like... The, the pay to win they have in this game is not like a problem for me, if you don't get me. Because uh, as far as I've understood is that you can buy all these items on Auction House. You can buy all the, tra the, the extra trades on Auction House. But you are not able to use any money in the game to actually give you the growth stones which you need for upgrading your gear. So yes, you can get faster to blue gear and purple gear. But you're not going to be able to upgrade them without playing the game so that's not really like bad for me like that's okay that's like okay i'm i can go out and grind and and yes and no look at the market yeah have you put the vpn on the browser you oh yeah 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 that's right um it's ace man you need to open up the VPN and also add the VPN into, you know, you, you, your browser needs to be also using the VPN. So you have, if you're using Chrome or Edge, you need to add that as well into the VPN. So uh, let me show you here. Your VPN should look like this. This. Look at this. Ace man. You should have Throne Liberty there, you should have NC Purple and your browser. And make sure your browser has a red dot under it, because I have disabled it. If you have that, you should be you should be fine. Uh, uh for example, look at the Nomas Sword. Nomas Sword. Norma. There's no Norma. Oh, you made Nerma. Nerma. Okay, yeah. Yeah, that's that's one Nerma. Okay. There's one on sale, is right? That sword and shield is incredible hard to get. Yeah, but like it has kind of the same stats as other weapons, doesn't it? I mean, it has the same like... So 99 players that get it one sale. It'll keep, right? Yeah. Bots can can get that kind of item, so in-game stuff. You need Ace Man, yeah, you need to change it to the one called Seoul Korea. All of them. All of them has to be Seoul Korea. Bots can get that kind of items, so in-game stuff. Won't be able to purchase. Also, it's just not, it's not just that you get the weapon. Also, you need to get it more than once. Yeah, because you need to like upgrade the mana region. Not, well, I mean, no, the mana region can be, yeah, yeah. If you need another trade, you need the same weapon with a different trade. But you don't have to buy the weapon for that. You can just buy these. 
uh, name it down here. You know the traits. You can. Yeah, but what if you get a trait like one of these unlock these traits here? If you get these traits here, but the same weapon. With the trait you want to unlock. After that, you can upgrade to level two and would free and free would extract. So what you're saying is the first upgrade requires the same weapon and not just trade. I see. Well, then I guess we have a, a very long grind in front of us. Oh no, why did I start this? No, I don't, I don't want to start this. So it's not so it's not like sale release and you can buy everything you want from market no chance yeah you will only be like able to buy the stuff that is a bit more generic like yeah, the one with higher drop chances but i mean i'm i'm, I'm confused with your point are you saying this is a good thing or bad thing because i don't see it like the biggest problem with that that just means that the people who actually does endgame stuff, they will have the items. And when they have enough of them, they can start selling them. And then everyone who wants to use money can, can follow them. So basically the good players who actually plays the game will have the items before the whales. Which I guess is a good thing, right? At the same time, you can get the same drops and sell it for that co same currency. Yeah, yeah and it, it, it all comes down to like, how hard is it to get that item? Uh, how am I getting over there? Coach is saying you could buy hundred dollar weapon that's going to help you a bit in front of some other people, but then the free to player goes to Nerma with his group and get the sword that play pay to win player couldn't. Like in a seven person group, you could get one sword every ten runs. Yeah, so it's just a matter of time and preference. You you can swipe, but you can just not swipe and play normally. Yeah, so there's going to be some benefits from swiping with some easy items and yada yada yada. But it's also going to be a game that would require you to play a lot. As well. So I guess we can say that's a good thing. Ah, oh, we have to get up there, shit. Exactly, yeah. And that's not a bad thing, like, I, yeah, and that's... That's kind of also, to my understanding, you know, it's it's not bad, it's like... That's okay. But you know, you know some people, the moment you can swipe your card and get something from it, they, uh... They will yell and cry about it's uh, pay to win. Not to run emo only the problem is is game should not sell loose in itself. Well I mean if the game is free to play, I understand why they do it, you know, because they wanna earn money and something. If it wasn't pay to win oh, sorry, wrong word. If it wasn't free to play, then I then I would agree. Then they could remove Lucent. If you had to buy the game, uh, not remove it, but you know, remove it so you can buy it.
same as Guild Wars 2, but in Guild Wars 2 you get max gear relatively fast, while in vertical grinding MO you can turn bad. Yeah, in Guild Wars 2 you can swipe your credit card and basically buy a legendary weapon, which is the best weapon in the game, so... Theoretically, Guild Wars 2 is also pay to win, because you can just swipe your card and get the best weapon in the game. Maybe not a lot, but you have to go Saturday or Sunday with your guild to defeat those guild bosses to get the good stuff. Player can sell items to each other, that means your effort and time is valuable and it's not pay to win. There's nothing like that in here. Speak with drunk or soldier. Oh god, I really hope there's like a point where I can jump up and get all these orcs off me. For Benny's item in Akage Valley. Ouch. There we go. Look for the prison key. In negative valley. Ah, uh, yeah, okay. Prison key. How do we get up from here? Uh, it's been three months since. It's been three months since release of this game, almost, and there's only one sword on the market for a high price. You can see, yeah. I mean, and that's the same in Guild Wars too. If you want to buy the legendary weapons, you also have to use a lot of money. Like, those are expensive. Unholy saying, yeah, but it's different. The pay to win relates to something you can get while grinding or take way too much time in Guild Wars 2. You can get that legendary you mentioned in less than a month. Too much. Does it only take like a month to get legendary weapon in Guild Wars? I thought it was like three months. What side did you get to use? Uh, Toya, welcome to the stream, good to see you. What sign did you use to get your account? Um, G2G. In case you want, I have a guide. There you go. This is the guide. I got my account from the website called G2G. In this video, I explain everything I did to play the game. And if you want to know uh, exactly which seller I bought from, uh, ping me on Discord and I will send you the exact link to the person I bought it from. But I recommend you to watch my video if you haven't read any guides about it. Appreciate the follow, man. Thanks for the follow. But if you follow my guide, it will basically tell you to... Just followed. Thanks for the follow. It, it will basically tell you to use uh, exit lag, use the VPN on this, 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 buy the account over here, boom, 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 boom. I'm not telling which buyer I'm buying from because I don't want to highlight any buyers in case they start, you know, cheating or something like that. So if you write to me in Discord, I'm just going to send you the link to the person I bought it from. So how do I get over there? Oh my god, no way that just happened. No freaking way that just happened. It was like, it was like this icon here and I was like, okay, fair enough. And then it just like runs out of. No, 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 Carl, no. Ugh. Unholy takes less, okay. 
Unholy, are you like uh, really good at Guild Wars 2? I have a few questions. Was but shoot. So if I, I know in World Wars' world, you can farm and then you can farm the entire ascended gear set from the vendor where first you need the box to unlock the skin and after you unlock the skin then you can buy the, the gear from the vendor. How long would that take you to farm? Because I did the calculation and that calculation showed an insane amount of time because you need those coins which you can only get like a very few of every you need some kind of like tailor coins, which you can only get like a very, very, very few amounts of every month. Yeah, PvP is not worth. Yeah, that's what I was seeing. Like that was insane. How much you had to grind versus world of world, world versus world. Because I I have never got any ascended armor gear, and I literally quit the game because I was like, yeah, this this grind is too much. Black mana stone. Oh, come on. Alright, so I just want just want some stone. Oh, this is not good. This is really not good. Yeah, you know what? I I I think I have a meeting. I I I gotta go. Yeah, I'm gonna I'm gonna come back and do this later. These are way too high level. You know, it was just like, you know, there was a mana stone, so I was like, yeah, okay, I can I can pick it up now. Like, if I'm getting allowed to take it, that would be nice. There we go. Oh, I need actually five of these. Holy moly, Apex raid with 18. I underscore bags just raided with 18 viewers. I appreciate it, Ibex. Appreciate it, man. Welcome, uh, welcome to the stream, and uh, thanks for the raid, man. Welcome, raiders. Hope you had a good stream. What what time zone are you in? are you in? Are you ending? Is it early for you or late? The Corpong update looks juicy. It did. It did. I'm gonna have an an updated video of that um, on Monday. I have to. How I do I have to pull this lever? What how what am I supposed to do? Cool, it was fun. I learned some things. Oh, it's twenty. Oh, it's okay. So you're one hour ahead of me. I see. Didn't realize. Uh, it was fun. It was fun learning some new, new things. It, it, but yeah, it, it was a really nice update. Uh, I just read it quick. I'm gonna have the bigger read of it when I make my video. Just all the sound a bit more excited. But uh, yeah, I hope you had a good stream, man. Thank you for the raid. Appreciate it. Pinti, Pinta, yes. Thank you for the follow, man. For sure. Fly and use scrapple mid air. You have to kill some mobs, you know. Oh yeah, but I'm gonna. Time to EA is just followed. I'm gonna wait with those mobs. Um... Oh, shit! That was nerve breaking. Six 
Wow, could you see if I had failed that one again? Oh god, I don't have to jump all the way back over there again. Fly and grapple me there. Go to bridge. Anytime, man. Yeah, I appreciate it. He is the one. Wait, I'm VIP? Yeah, I, I added you as VIP. You know, I got like... Well, it's like 100 of them. So I'm gonna, gonna, gonna use it on some. <laughs> Just giving you a shout out. But thanks for the rate, man. Uh, Dvalon, if you signed up for Ubisoft Creator Program, they give you free Hermit copies of Skull and Bones. All worth 90 USD, maybe worth getting the keys to the stream. Nah, I think I clicked, you know, I haven't clicked on that game as I'm interested in it, so they're, gonna, they're not going to send it to me. I usually add people to um, VIP when I have seen them like, you know, on two or three streams. Which reminds me, I actually haven't... Um, I forgot to do it with Unholy. Unholy copy of life. There we go. I don't know, it's like fun to put it on people that you have seen like coming back. What do we have to do now? We have to go over there. Oh my god, what the hell? So A back, so you what what? It threw like a spear into me while I was flying. A back, so you more excited for um Call Punk than Throne of Liberty or Throne of Liberty more than Call Punk? So that's the plan. I needed to get it get prisoned. Oh, I see. Very smart. Very smart. Hi, uh, Tasteman. Have you heard about the problem where the game loads to the Unreal Engine logo and crashing? No, I have not. That one is new for me. Are you experiencing that or have you just seen people experiencing that? Kaylin, did you actually write something about you just completed the golem quest before? Oh yeah, you wrote even 50 minutes till the event. I didn't why did why I'm not seeing your messages, Kaylin? finally got through the golem challenge did you do as um the chat said you know where you had to do like number four five three two two one or something like that apex corpong is a whole different game yeah and I, I know like but you know my, my what i'm saying is like you know uh corpong is one type of mmo this is one type of mmo which type are you most excited for because Cold Punk is more going to be like this open world survival MMO where everything is like an adventure, where this is just like, you know, grindy, grindy, grindy. And fun, grind, fun, grind, fun. It takes me, I can't get into the game, yes. So your account is finally done, but when... That's weird. Have you updated your graphic card to the newest version? Kaylin, I just tried the golem challenge. It worked till it worked. Oh, so you just like kept 
pressing every button or did you follow that rotation the guy uh, so silo chat mm, thanks i'll check that yeah try try that i think i heard something about they fixed something in that graphic update Ace bags are generally hard to pick. I'm just excited for both. A little less about Teal, now that I've played it for two months daily. Yeah, I know what you mean. But at least with Teal, you know, we have seen the vanilla version of the game, and there could be so many cool things coming in the future, which may be like. So I have to watch the bump. Kaylin, remember, oh my god, just, uh, can I finish this in five minutes or should I leave this? Uh... Yeah, because this is going to take more than five minutes, right? This is a plus 15 minutes, okay. Yeah, it seems like a pretty long one. All right, we, we're gonna we're gonna come back. Do I just have to go over and click on it again to restart it? Like, can I just go? Yeah, I can just go and restart it again. Okay, cool. Event time. Anymore. I can't wait for them to actually like, change, you know, how events works. Right now, it doesn't make sense to group up with people and do events, but I really can't wait for them to change it so it makes more sense to have a small group and do it together. Like shared loot. I know they said something about it. God damn it. Frenzy. There we go. Uh, great. So now we basically just wait here till the event begins because it seems like the event is this place here. <sighs> Just gonna unpin all the quests. Gonna go away from all these different people. Now that I remind myself. So, are you still here, um, folks? Oh, are you still here? For me, the only event that's worth are the guild events. See, the only reason I need this event is because I have a quest with it. Uh, this one here. That's that's why I want to do it.
that one, yeah. Participate in the mana, in the stop mana frenzy at mana waste and deliver demonic mana stones. Yeah, that's the only reason I want to do it. So, uh, Cox, are you saying this is um, these events here are the ones that are going to be a, uh, those automatic groups, right? So these PP events here are going to be the new one that's going to be with the automatic groups. See the rear for two versus two hundred versus is kind of chaotic. They will change it for guild versus guild. Ah, uh, yeah, okay. So this is not the one where they're gonna make that alliance system with automatically jo joining each other. It's a, it's crashing because my CPU, but my CPU meant the game's recommended requirements. No, you will get the line system on the other PP events. Look at the event table. Like these, Blood Mushroom Gathering, Requiem of Light. These PP events, conf oh. So if I, not now, now it would be still alliance versus alliances, uh, like the real guilds and alliances. But in the future, when they come with the update, then I will be assigned as some kind of like random group. It's Ace Man. What kind of um, what you, what you build, if I may ask? Now everyone can kill you. Yeah. So we're gonna wait doing those till um, they come with that new system. Do we know when that system comes? Okay, this is a big arena event it's gonna be in. Anyone who has some tips for this event? Stop the mana frenzy? Is it basically just kill demons and turn in this, the, you know, the items? That's it. No time soon, they said June or... Unless I was told wrong. Okay, so it's gonna be the same with the they it's basically gonna come out with the arena system. With the new arena system. Just kills mobs and deliver to the points marked on minimap. I see. Like Valen, thank you, Kaylin. Thank you. So will this one have the same as the one with the seeds, where sometimes you can deliver to double about double points? Or is it only the seed one? Can this one also have the double points? No, not on this one. Okay. So on this... Okay, so basically I just uh, kill and deliver. I hadn't understood this one. Isn't... Isn't it just kill, deliver? Um... 9900k? Oh, an i9. Nine nine oh, okay, an RT. I see. Task manager hit my CPU and captured at hundred in loading time. Oh, so it it uses so much. I know when I boot up the game, my CPU goes crazy. Like it goes up to eighty percent. Like it sounds like a plane. But then once you get through the loading screen at the main menu then it sounds fine it's just like something they have done with the boot up that is weird then i'm sure you're not the only one who has that problem yep deliver a few so the mission counts and don't leave the rear the game is just very cpu heavy it is and I'm very happy I just bought a very brand new PC. Maybe forcing it to load faster since it doesn't have loading screens. Yeah, it, it might be like it loads up every, very thing, like every little thing at the start. Can't get the past to boot up. Hmm.
is I guess you... I mean, the best you could do is go to the Reddit page and tell your problem there, and then I'm sure like someone has maybe experienced it and... You know, yeah, maybe... I, 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 like in your case, I would ask on the, the Reddit. I've seen people even with the integrated graphics being able to boot up the game. Yeah, I can, e I can even play it on my shitty Steam Deck. Now that I'm thinking about it. Yeah, that's weird. I can even play it on my Steam Deck. I hadn't thought about that. Maybe something... Sp yeah, it could be like it's exactly that one you have it has a problem with. Which is, of course, very unlucky. My wife's free, and I know his ex had no issues of her. Hmm. My game used to crash at main menu until I found out you can change from Korean to English localization in purple, and then it didn't crash anymore. Ah, Ace Man, have you tried that? When you, if you lock out of purple, you can choose like a country. Have you, have you, are you sure you selected, um, um, what's called Korea, and also try change your time on your PC so it's plus nine. Seoul, Korea. So your time zone is the same as their time zone. Change the time zone, restart the PC, and yeah. Oh, you have to change time zone, or is it bug? Uh, some people have to change time zone. I I, I know a few people from US. Um, I couldn't get in game if not change. Yeah, I know a few people who couldn't get in if they didn't change time zone. I'm just gonna deliver those coins now to make sure that. Um, I complete my quest. There we go. Speak with all this sanctuary oasis. All right, I'm going to do that after the event. Now I'm just going to finish the event. Have we heard anything about when they're gonna change the events so you can actually do them with groups? Um, so you don't have to like... Um, Apex, you don't have to change the time zone if you're from Europe and the only people in, I knew that had to change the time zone were people in the US. Yeah, I was literally helping one where I was watching his screen, you know, we had Depop for a few minutes. Then we for fun tried to um, change the time zone and boom, it worked. He attacked my mob one time, he got the loot. God damn. Strange, anyway, I'm Lurk. Well, I'll finish my salad. Well, enjoy your salad, man. A good salad, 11 p.m. in the evening. Uh -huh, I guess I have to learn a bit more where the mobs are for this event.
Uh, Jimakos, welcome to the stream, Jimakos. Good to see you. Hey, how are you today? I'm doing well, very well, very well. How about yourself, man? Uh, Cox is saying sword and wand is a weird combo. It really is, but for some reason I, I like it. It's fun. I like all the self healing it has. Whenever I attack a target that has my curse on, it has that vampiric debuff thing. That just. Pretty sure, like a great sword dagger would probably do more damage. Uh, I ate the good stuff first earlier. <laughs> I see. Well, were you getting like a big meal or something? Damn, that guy, he like almost one shot at that one. Doing good, thank you for asking. Well, I mean, you asked first. But I appreciate it, man. Also, one has a passive that heals you from X amount of damage to you. Yeah, that's, that's the one that I'm using, uh, but it requires me to put the curse on them first. Uh, this one here, Vampiric Contract. I like it. It used to work in dungeons as well, I would heal everyone around me, but then the, a patch came and then suddenly it didn't work anymore. It would only heal myself when I had my sword on, which was weird. Great Scott Dagger is one of the highest DPS in the game. You have to click on the You have to click on you have to click to their name. On their name. No, I'm I'm talking about the healing from this passive one. It's supposed to like it says here that it will if a friendly target is, is within it's not within your range, you will do heal. It says here restore health on a friendly target. Of the damage you deal to the target affected by of the target damage. Oh can you like target a heat? But how can you do damage while targeting a friendly? That doesn't make sense. You can have both time. What? Because when you target a mob, you are in party. You can start. Oh yeah, I think I have seen that. But I have seen that where it's like a target next to my target, like a target and target. Like there was like two targets up here. I just first thought it was like you know target targets, you know like a, it's my target's target. Because when you're on your part, yep, that one, the blue sky. Oh, I see. I gotta test that. I gotta, I gotta try the level twenty dungeon after this event and test that. Because I, I was doing pretty cool healing on, um, on the tank with my sword. Like, I was doing really good healing because I was like doing a lot of attacks.
also you also you know healers ain't actually healers i'm main healer and i feel that the most time i'm depicting is the healing i guess the reason also for why you know we like yeah because uh Kaelin, i've done a lot of dungeons with our healer and i guess like you know the reason for why you also do a lot of damage is because you have this passive but also because you don't you only have two healings so you can't really do more so every time you do damage you also heal right you didn't know you could have a heal target? I did. I, no, I didn't know. You never told me. <laughs> I was just like, why am I never healing anyone? Like, you know, um, of course, when I when I heal with my other two spells, I would just click on them. But with my passive one, I thought it would randomly select one. I didn't know I had to, like, click on someone for it to work. Focus on upgrading that blue weapon to plus nine. Uh, yeah. I need more shots. So, um, since I'm having this fun weapon combo, there's not many guides on the net to sh tell me what stats I should do. If you guys should guess what my stats should look like as a great sword wand, what would you say? Because right now I went 30 strength, 30 dexterity, and then all rest in um, perception. I have done nothing in wisdom. Just 30 strength, 30 dexterity, and rest in perception. With yellow missions, you can do it pretty fast. Okay. And by yellow, yeah, you mean contracts, right? It'll be easy when you hit 50. God, why is there so many people here? Like, that's insane how many people who was here. gonna be on top 100 it feels like everyone else is like one shotting where i'm just like using half an hour to kill mobs what's up the blue item which i i would say strength takes three till it takes two pins to upgrade perception increase your base damage will increase your healing that's the thing with this game all the build works Okay, so that actually sounds like my build is actually decent. 30 strength, 30 dexterity until they cost the two I stop, and then rest in perception. Perception increases your base damage, which increases your healing. Good. That's the thing with this game, all the builds works. That is pretty cool, like... I, I feel it's cool. Like, you know, you look at me and he's like... I even wrote about my build in Discord, so I already underwrote it. And some other people were like, I'm running the same build as you. I even found another streamer who runs the same build as me, which is pretty cool. <laughs> Back at you. Where can I find expert grave robber in hidden brown Mika?
Uh, <laughs> uh, I would have to Google that. What kind of le what level mission is it? It's like a little forty mission, thirty mission, twenty mission. Jeez, why is it all of these people? You can see what the stat does if you press ALT on the top of the map. I think also when you like pick up this the stat right, when you pick it, it shows like on the right side what it actually does. Main max damage, max mana, mana region. Okay, that's nice. That's really nice. Thanks for that L tap. Even strength gives more damage. Wow, perception gives like a lot. Uh, it costs too. I don't think I'll go straight for healing and western release. It costs too much and you fall behind because you can't do events. But isn't that going to change? Because you know they said they're gonna change events. So you're actually gonna be able to do them with friends and you both get rewards. So I mean that's gonna change if you play with someone. Ah uh, yeah yeah yeah, okay. As you say, on unless of course they are fixed. Rowan blue mission and the blue mission, the peace event. I see. Burn, burn. Look at that. Burned on the wall and AoE healing and it's nice. So I tried an Ace Man, so I try a no log, I think I have installed a different drive. And I'm going to uninstall and reinstall my other drive and hopefully help. Yeah, you should you should definitely try have it on your like your main drive while you have Windows on. In case you haven't tried that. That could do some magic perhaps. Found it it's the peace event near Stomas and Town. I see. I was saying, but actually, it doesn't even matter. If events don't bring much to the table, you can skip most of them and still progress. Uh, Ace, I was just saying, uh, have you tried having the game installed on the same drive as your Windows? Like, you know, if your C drive. I really found a place here where no one else is. so fun when I have a curse on them both and I do this spin to win spell um, both of them it heals me because they both have like the curse on I had it on my C drive and it wasn't working oh okay Sucks. Now you have had all those problems with 
getting the account and you finally get an account and now you have a problem with even booting up the game. Like what are the chances for that? I should probably soon go up and deliver my points. Form your PC and reinstall. <laughs> that's a big uh, that's a big thing just for trying to see I mean imagine it didn't still work. Oh Yeah, I know. Oh, I love this man testing my patient. If something like that happened to me, I'm I'm that kind of like IT nerd. If some if I have like problems like that, I can't sleep. I I will sit at the PC till I find a solution. Like literally, I can't leave the PC till some it, it works. I get so frustrated. Oh my god, no, 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 no. 10 seconds back, and I haven't delivered. And I can't deliver here. They just is. I had 60 points I could deliver. Oh my god. Ah, oh, this is so dumb. This is so dumb. Oh well, what did I learn from that? Go and deliver in better time next time. Oof, are you doing going to make it? Nope. Unholy, I posted in your Discord to SS of my char. Oh, screenshots. Oh, very nice. I have the same dragon. I use the same dragon for my flying mount. The gear you have on, is that skinny shop gear or is that actually in-game gear? Oh well, Kaelin. I came on the hunt exactly 100 plays. So I still got some XP out of it. Okay. Back to that. So basically, this is. Yeah, so I'm clicking on you. Ah, uh, I see. So you are now my healing target. And this is now my normal target. Mm -hmm. Why didn't I know that? I can make a video about it. It just gave me material for another guide. How to heal in Throne and Liberty. I can already see all the views. screenshots pretty cool character you got there I ranked 96 on the event god damn you better than me you you better player I better get good unholy skins weapons are legendary promoters the rare star skins bought with either silver or gems bought with silver as well I see I just redeemed like 9,000 gems to my account, um, which I have got from, um, because I was part of that Guild Wars 2 content creator program, so they kept sending me shards, which I could give away, um, but then they paused my m p partnership, because you know, I don't play the game anymore, and then I was like, I'm just gonna use all the gems, <laughs> so I got 9,000 gems. Class Dead Eye pretty much maxed in fusion. Yeah, I was thinking something like Dead Eye when I saw you and gone. Oh no, welcome to the stream. Is it 
hey, is it viable with great sword and wand? Everyone seems to say that it that in late game you either you need you're neither good at DPS nor healing. Thanks for the response. <laughs> it's probably not gonna make it to you know the S tier or the S the A tier on the meter list. It might be like a B tier build, maybe. Um But for me I like I enjoy it. And by the way, welcome to the stream. I, I enjoy the build. Um, I like the self-healing from it. I like the healing that I can give to my teammates. I think it's pretty cool. Um, so I guess it's more like a preference. Of course, if you want to be meta, then you're going to go wand and bow. And if you want to be like that's healing one bow healing if you want to do damage great sword dagger you know you're gonna go with those really like a tier s tier specs mine is more like a very rare one Healing is staff worn top tier. Oh, okay. I, I just saw there. I just saw a lot of people saying the wand and bow was really good because the bow has that regeneration one you can drop on the ground, which gives really like a lot of healing. In game, I think longbow crossbow is good for PvE. That I cannot answer. And no mana after five heals, lol. I see. So mana, mana wand is actually the new meter. To heal a lot of times on dungeons but what does the staff do for you is it because the staff has a spell where you get all your mana back i'm just trying to find out like why is the staff good so this is going to increase my melee hit by more base damage matching hit weak and shan blah 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 Staff gives a lot of mana. Okay, so that's the reason. I see. Makes sense. Region, mana region skill. Star should be good for mana region and all that wee stuff. I'll read the skills for some of the mana. I see. I'm a VIP? Yeah, yeah, I promoted you. Because you know, unholy. I've, I've actually, as I said, I, I promote people to VIP when I've seen them quite a lot of times, you know, in the stream. And I have seen you like many times. No, it doesn't really do, do anything. It's just a batch, but I, I guess that's the big, biggest thing I can do as saying thanks for being a returning viewer. Sadly, sometimes I can only come to say hello. Shadow doesn't let me stay more, and that's totally fine. Like even like just saying hi is more than I can uh, wish for. Hey, Mattis, welcome to the stream. First time chatter. Could 
could be this new big M could this be the next like are you basically asking if this is gonna be the next big MMO? I think definitely this game could be like something big. It's not gonna be the wow killer because the game I think is gonna have too much grind and it's not solo friendly for maybe like you know there's a lot of people who play World of Warcraft who never plays with other people. They just play the game alone always. Literally plays it as a single play game. Those people are not gonna find this game interesting. <laughs> oh, should be. Well, you know, then they made Season of Discovery and everyone got hyped again and they keep finding ways to make the game interesting. I mean, even on, even I uh, might, you know, I, I'm kind of like, you know, I want to see what the next expansion can do. All within, it seems interesting. Uh, so I'm, I mean, I'm even excited for the next expansion. Yeah, the next expansion of World of Warcraft. I'm excited. But again, it's it's gonna come out in August around there. And I really hope this game has released before. I really, really hope. The worst thing that would happen is if this game releases at the same time with the new WoW expansion. That would be horrible. Basis, so I heard this creates something new in MMOs, like what? Uh, I don't know if it's new, because you know, a lot of the things you have in this game is already in Lineage 2. But I guess it combines a lot of like different things from MMOs into one game, which I guess people like. You know, it has big castle wars, open world PvP, uh, a weapon class system, dungeons. So I don't know if this game has any unique thing, uh, which we haven't seen in other games. I knew that guy was evil. He really reminded of like some kind of evil guy. Uh, unholy, do we have any? Do we have any life skills, gathering, fishing, training, sailing. Basically, you can do all that, you know, like um, gathering stuff. But it won't give you more. Ex it you're not progressing in it. It's basically just for getting materials. Oh, okay. Even that Arthur guy is evil. So you you gather you gather items but you don't get like up in gathering. It's more it's a thing everyone can do. If they went over here I could use that farm. Oh, okay. Didn't do much. You have to have so much HP. Those bombs actually take a big portion of his life.
But he keeps attacking that guy there, so it's pretty hard to get him over here. Oh, I see. Fang's good. It's not a life skill le like you level up, but you need potions, you need to gather. Yeah, this fight is... <laughs> there you go, come. Come over here, come here. I'm gonna stun you, gonna click on the bomb, and I'm gonna leave it. Thank you. But yeah, that's right on hold. You can do crafting and all that shit, but you're not gonna level up in it. Basically, you just need the materials and that's it. Come, 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 come. Click the bomb. God damn it. For some reason, he didn't take the damage. There we go. Uh, Turek, welcome to the uh, YouTube uh, stream. I mean, these main quests give so freaking much XP. I mean, this is ridiculous. It's just like... I just got more like that, more than a half... I think more than an entire level. this look for the surface that connects the reduce connect the mana with the glowing orb Because guys, I'm all for today. I just passed by to say hi. Many thanks, and and we expected more nice and educated videos. <laughs> I will definitely come with more good and educated videos, man. Thanks for stopping by the stream. I appreciate it, man. Have a have a good night and sleep well, man. Sleep well. to activate it somehow or am I done should definitely try BDO. I have tried BDO many, 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 many times. And the combat just... The combat just kills it for me. 
you know the combo combat i'm just not i'm not really not good at combos right like really really not good at combos but i mean why play bdo when i have this just takes times not hard trust me fair enough <laughs> Oh, okay, so I have to put it... Okay, I have to, like, open it, and then it's on time. Unholy, I'm sorry, I can't remember. Are you on uh, the Korea server right now, or are you waiting? Mean? <laughs> I'm not trying to be mean. You're waiting, okay. Kog is saying, video is like playing Street Fighter on MMO. Yeah, that's like, and I've never been good at street fighting games. So when I tried video, I was like, God damn it. Did you see that lag? What was that lag? What the hell was that? Rone after years of BDO, Rone Liberty is a breezing regarding skills. Yeah, you don't even have to like uh, remember the combos. Well, you're on, on the on USA and the Soyuz in Korea. No, 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 no. no. I'm uh, I'm from Denmark, so I'm actually sitting in uh, Europe. But still the same. I know what you mean. <laughs> exactly. But yeah, it's the same. I think I have like right now... Um, how much latency do I have? I have... 167 Well, you are on Denmark and the sale is in Korea. I mean Korea is Yeah hot in here. What's my PC doing right now? Yeah, it's not too bad. Not too bad. I want I'm actually curious about something. Let me try. So my CPU right now is using my GPU is using 80 and my CPU is using 40. If I turn down graphics, I wonder if it's gonna like. This one is set to quality though. 
in case I change everything from epic to high. So right now it's 40 and 80. So 40% CPU, 80% GPU. Let's say when it's very hot outside, like summer, and I want my PC to cool down a bit more. So if I change everything to high instead, then the game runs. That's really weird. Now my CPU is 50% and my GPU is 50%. So it's kind of like my GPU, CPU is using more now and my GPU is using less now. Kind of like they traded. Roan CPU 40, GPU 40. What settings are you using right now, Roan? Are you like ultra, high, medium? Epic, okay. So you must have a better GPU than me since mine was using 80. I have a 4070. What, do you have like a 4090 or something? Oh, 4090, yeah, bro. Like, I, are you like, can I West little bro or something? Like, how can you afford a 4090? Oh. 90 that one that graphic card costs more than my freaking entire pc he's a mob i'm a hooker you are hooker i see Well, I'm a, I'm a, I'm jealous. I am definitely jealous. Well, I'm still happy for my 4070. But uh, I was, no, bro, it took me three years to save the money. Ah, I see, I see, I see. So you actually, you actually saved. Where in my case, I didn't save. I just like bought it without. I was just like, oh, what do I have on my account? Okay, I have enough for 4070. Fair enough. Well, an old man dick is worth the 4090. Fair enough. Fair enough. I just got another level just by talking to these people. Like, god damn. These last five levels is like insane quick. For the build. Oh, bro, to got a 2080 here. What can I say? <laughs> for my old PC is i7 and oh, okay. I see, I see, I see. Well, then it was a worthy upgrade. Like that was a very worthy upgrade. Fox is saying I enjoyed this boss, first mechanic boss, I actually enjoyed on this game. So I'm gonna do a boss now? Oh, he looks pretty cool. Not sure if you're fighting the no face boss or the one with the hearts. Leave the talent guild. Kaylin, are you the same part of the story as me right now? So a question to the Front Liberty pros in the chat right now. What kind of items should I... I know I'm using a really weird build with Wand and Greatsword, but what kind of items should I use? Because right now I have the entire set called Leader Resistance Visor, 
uh, sorry, leader, leader. Like it's kind of like I think like a kid, bit tanky. You know, all the items has has either health regen, evasion. Sh for like you should focus on damage so you can heal more. What kind of stat do you need on your items? Because I was reading all the different stats and I was just like, none of this makes sense. They all had like no, none of them is just saying damage. They all have like weird strength damage, dex critical, and damage. I see. So for example here, with this one here, I should not take the one called plate resistant boots. Because that's give me... Ah, I see. So this one here gives me purely wisdom also damage, but not too much. So this one here gives me crit hit. Oh, you have an add. Okay. Uh, we need a membership to Cox. I tend to to do a lot of research before buying, and when I get something, I get it with the plan to keep it for years. Not really in two years upgrade again. I do research on each part and want to try and combine them as best as possible for a good outcome. And I kind of wanted a bit future proof. And then the shop I got it from comes with three years replacement on parts. That's nice. Yeah, I mean with that PC you have now. You don't have to buy a new PC for four or five years, like for real. You are good to go for a long time. So this one has max health, crit hit. Hit, max health, melee defense, crit hit. None of these items is for damage. All these items here are purely defense. Uh, Quarks, you but you should be back now. But I see all these items here are purely tank items because they all just have defense and hit. Like the only one that has a bit damage on is this one here, which is like hit and then max health. Max health crit hit, melee defense crit hit, weaken resistance, melee evasion. I can even choose between crit hit or hit. That's it. Crit hit or hit. So it feels like these are not really worth it. I guess I should just pick one random. Third one is leather. But does it make a difference that it's leather? Like, I know it's leather, but like, does it do anything because it's leather? Or is it just like the look of it? This leather has different trade options. Oh, I see. So plate normally comes with like very defensive traits. Where well, leather comes with a lot of damage traits. And. Oh, okay, so both of these are leather. Elite resistant leather and moonlight grace leather. And I don't want these magic shoes, right? Because, like, and played physical damage. And with when I'm running, like, warned. I should, you know, as you're saying, I should go for the leather more than clove. Like, don't go clove, more go leather. No, you got one most likely for passives. Exactly. Yeah. You won't be able to DPS and heal at the same time. Yeah, so I just want to heal with that passive one where I do a lot of damage. Most of the time, because of the time, you got the skills on purple. They will take a lot of mana. I see, okay. 
Coolio. So now, that before I can do my last... Appreciate the tips, by the way. Before I can do the last chapter in the game, I need to be level 50. So you have to focus on doing damage and healing with passive. Yep. This... Would my build be able to do... Would you say yourself, would this build be enough to heal as a main healer? Or would this only be like a additional supporter to another healer? Or would you think this would be enough? No, absolutely no. Okay. So it would just be a fun damage build with a damage over time debuff. That can help the healer. Which of course a lot of people will be like, why do we need you? There's your decent DPS that helps the healer healing the other DPS that has low HP pull. I see. Well, I mean, when you do raids where you're like 10, 20, 30 people, I guess it doesn't... Bro, what is this stupid high damage on gear score dagger? What the... Yeah, that's, that should be the meter, if I understand right. Passive stacking to synced. You're almost there, exactly. We are so close to max level. Dagger gears is OP right now, same as tank. Gears, great sword. Yeah, I was running the great sword shield before. I was thinking of doing some of the blue um, kizzy. Some blue dab and deep and da. Oh wait, no, I oh yeah, I have unlocked the um, I have unlocked level 49 contracts now. I wanna try some of them. Great sword dagger is not as OP against bow. Bow wand? Do yellow and get weapon tokens. Uh, yellow, 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 yellow. Yep. Let's try this. So weapon tokens, these. So basically, so I should ignore like the place where they are. I should just like go for the weapon tokens to just upgrade my weapon. Or should I take five that is in the same area? Or should I just like weapon, weapon? Weapon, 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 weapon. Yep, okay. Yeah, uh, Natoran, I, I get, you know, when you say, like, the same place. I get what you mean, like, the same place, of course, that will be fastest, I will get most XP out of it. But, for example, if I want to upgrade my weapon... Yeah, that's the thing, like, if I really want to upgrade my weapon, of course, then I would need, like, um... Okay, let's see how many weapons we can get. There we go. Five weapons. So this should give me hopefully enough to upgrade my weapon. That was evil. I'm gonna wait with upgrade. I'm not gonna upgrade my wand because it's my weapon I'm actually attacking with. Is it worth upgrading my armor even though it's the wrong armor? Like this is like very defense armor. But I guess it's okay to still upgrade them to transfer into like Neo. <laughs> How did you manage survival and bow in one mid level? Drove me not to change the class. That is also how you You can transfer XP to other armor. Yeah. So it's probably like fine.
There we go. And we got no items I can sell. As I look at the dungeons and see what plate items they drop. So you can farm those dungeons and get trays on those armors. But isn't there ways to get trades on them if I in any way have to get like damage items? Or I just made a green dagger now because I had loads of materials left and decided to try it and gear score slowly. Oh, Coke, you just, you just said that I should, you know, get some more plate stuff to get some more trades, but I was just saying, like, is that worth it when if I need, you know, litter ammo instead? I guess I should replace all my gear with, like, litter ammo. If this was on Europe server, I would just have swiped my credit card and bought a full set of um, litter ammo. <laughs> But um, sadly, it's not on Europe. You should replace them with the blade you can farm. Because if you have to farm a lot to get the same armor you're wearing, it will be painful. Yeah, I guess you are right in that. If you have to farm a lot to get this armor in dungeon, you can get X armor and it will drop from time to time the same you farm the dungeon. Paulus chest. So you farm all the same items pretty much. And I know for that chest you can first get that in like level 50 dungeons. The one MVP, wait a minute, is this game live? No, this game is only live in Korea at the moment. Um, so I'm playing on Korean server. We sadly don't know when it comes to Europe or NA yet. Um, but we think Q3. He has 50 dungeons, drops Paolo's, then drops your purple weapon. I see. There we got Nataron. My fast damage dealer. This will make it a bit faster. <laughs> Click on his name so you can see. Ah, yeah, 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 yeah. So now when I... I see, yeah, now he gets all the healing. And 
Is there like a button to cancel that so I start healing myself? Ah, control X. I see. Oh no, 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 no. I pressed C. Oh well, I just wasted a... Uh... Use skill 2 after 6 for bonus damage? 100%. 100%. I just sometimes don't use it, like in case if I wanted to like stun, you know, I kind of learned that from dungeons, you know, sometimes you don't want to use it because they, you have to wait till they use a certain mechanic. But yeah, I know it would be like, uh, it's like way much more damage. And welcome to the stream, uh, Kanoa. This one is also low, isn't it? Yeah. All right, that was uh, one. Gather mushrooms. I have to find mushrooms. There's a dot over here. Like a yellow dot. What is that dot? Oh, that's an orc fighter. Okay, I have a quest as well with these. Then I have to extinguish, extinguish the fires of Flamkan. I guess we could just run. Kanoa, if you're still here, what kind of build do you play? Mushrooms. I need mushrooms for the quest. There we go. And then I need to turn off a light over here. Gives room. <laughs> Turn off the light. Nice. And then we need some more shrooms. Do I have other quests here? I actually have. What is the chance I pick five weapon quests which all are the same place? Let's get the mana. Pinky ping. The mana pinky ping goes over here. Look at that, that's a book. A little book. Uh, where's that mana thing? Is it? Oh, there, below me. Um, operate the magic magic circle. I have to go to some kind of magic circle. This is kind of magic, magic. This is some. Isn't this like a song with that? This is some magic. 
Oh, there's a buzz over here. Should we kill him? Orc Shadow Elder? Maybe kill the mobs before we take him. Now I will stun you. So I can deal more damage. I think there's something they they haven't told because there's a little detail they haven't um, said in the you are only able to heal the people as far as possible as your weapon range so when I have my my sword on I can only heal the people with my passive who's around me But if I take my wand on, I can heal them way longer. Just a funny uh, little detail they don't mention. What is it I have need to have here? Operate the magic circle? Oh, okay, I actually have to click on it. Ouch. God damn it. Then I also get this guy on me. Oh, that's one of those where the mobs keep coming then. Because see, my passive can heal him now, all over there. But if I switch to my my sword, and I attack this one here, don't follow me. I need to prove a point. See, then it heals me instead. Then it's not able to heal him. Which is really, like, it's annoying. Because it basically just proves that Wand is not so efficient with Greatsword or even any melee weapons. Sadly. Okay, I just need to collect shrooms now. You know a good spot for shrooms? Ruffy Panda, good to see you man, welcome to the stream. Welcome, welcome, welcome. Ah, nice. Now I just need one more. You've seen another one. What is this odd looking game? What you mean? This is the 
critical acclaimed triple A MMORPG Throne and Liberty. Abraham, welcome to the YouTube stream. How do I get how to get New Year coin? I'm actually not sure. I just all get them all the time in my uh, mail. Like you can see here. There. In my mail. In my mail. I just keep getting them. Never heard of it. <laughs> ah, you funny. Contracts and mail. Okay. I appreciate it. Second. I just don't see it. Like, I, I mean, I... And this is a contract, you know. So like, I don't get any um, New Year coins here. Thanks for the help, uh, Natron. Do we have any? Um, so I'm, I should have got like a, yeah. This is what I'm like. See, I've got a lot of upgrade tokens. What was that? 10%, 10%. Come on. Do we even have... What is this game all about? So fluffy panda, like you you don't know this game, or are we are we on joking level right now? Because if you don't know, I will happily explain it. But I don't want. Yeah, I just can't remember fluffy. Have you seen me play this game before or not? Or are you in the guild even? I just I can't remember. Sorry. Are you actually in the guild? See the way you the way you're writing that it even makes me like <laughs> it, it even makes me like you sus you sus bro <laughs> absolutely not trolling guys you naughty naughty you teasing me <laughs> you naughty naughty <laughs> oh. Well, if you would like, I can explain you what, what this game is about, in case you want. Uh, contracts. Contract, man, that sword is so freaking cool. Emotional damage! Emotional damage. Weapon, thank you for that. Weapon, 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 weapon. Yeah. Oh, that one is 50 50. Ooh, that is dangerous. Weapon, 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 weapon. Weapon, 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 weapon. All right. Just got like new, um, Missions. Let's see. The first one is over there. The second one is over here. The third one is over there. Got one in the augeria. Two. Okay. Two in the augeria and three over here. So let's do those over there first. The one in this werewolf place, I guess it is. Uh, have I got a new morph? I, I'm tired of looking at my kitty cat. Uh, let's do the bird. Oh, 
what were you saying about ward and sword so basically i have discovered that um the passive oh you do you, do you have an ad right now because it's telling me right now there's an ad break can tankerous gamer welcome to stream i'm good to see you for your information just tried logging in and can't do to real name verification don't lock out all right can can tankerous gamer so you still here or are you seeing ad right now playing on korean servers from us i'm still here just tried logging in and can't do to real name verification. Wait, are you saying they're trying to get us all back? Like, are they trying to destroy all our accounts again? Cox, did you hear that? Cantangra is saying that he tries to log in and it says that he needs a real name verification. Are we going to all have to start over again? If we have, I'm I'm done. Like for real, I'm done. <laughs> then I tried it. I made a few videos. That's fine. But I hope not. Did you change all the account data? Here's what I get. This account is not tied to a legal name. Verify your legal name before using the PC game service. We did change name when we got when we uh, got. I think I changed the name on my account. You know when I bought it. It seems like you bought a one dollar account. Yeah, because when I bought mine, I changed the email, the phone number, the password, and I even think like the name. When I go through the fingerprint, it forces me to use one of the four Korean phone companies. I see. Even if you change everything, you can get back. You can get back account with a real identity card. Yeah, but I change everything too. Yeah, I change everything on my account. I can log in purple just fine. Have you seen on Reddit if like anyone else is talking about it? Like, if it's like a like a bigger issue. You should try ask on Reddit to see if like anyone else has this issue. Um, so Cox, uh, if, in case you wanted to know what I have discovered. I found out the passive healing you can do only works with the same range your weapon has. So when I have my two hand sword on, I can only passively heal people from the same distance my my sword can attack. But if I have my wand on, it can heal from the same distance my wand has. So it kind of kills the point actually, which is a bit sad. I think it just proves that this build is not it's not the goat. So it sucks pretty much. Yeah. And it's just weird because I feel like it worked. I tried it one time in a dungeon and it kind of worked. And yeah, I guess I just have to switch back to dagger. You know, I tried to be a paladin. I really wanted to be a paladin, but the game doesn't want me to be a paladin. You can just buy, be a selfish guy and sustain yourself. Who cares about your team, right? <laughs> oh, I, we just tested it before. Like, okay, so Natron, if you can stand here, if you stand still here, then I can show it. See, now I'm going to throw the curse on him. I have him as a healing target. 
he's not getting healed. The moment I switch to my wand, now he gets healed. The moment I switch back to my sword, now he doesn't get healed. Now I get healed instead. So it is based on the weapon range, which is... It's just, it's just sad they don't say it. Like, if they have told me... If a friendly target is within your range, like... What is within your range? It should say within your weapon range. But again, I guess it's something that went wrong with the translation. But yeah, unholy you, you have a point. I could be selfish and just be like... Nothing can kill me. Remember it's translated from Korean in a way that it's not designed for. Yeah, so it will probably look different like when Amazon translated. Uh, what is that? Collect? Collect werewolf pictographs? I have to collect some items over here. Well, within your range can refer to your current attack range. But I think it doesn't even say that. Uh, there, oh, there it is. That is what I need. Please don't interrupt me. Nice. You have tried switching wand and having a gears a second. Yeah, and when I have my when I have my wand in my main hand, then I can do long healing. And when I have my um greatsword in main hand, then I can do only short healing, like you know, range wise. So with wand longbow will work? Yeah. With a longbow it would work, yeah. Well of within your range yeah. This could be take some pressure from your healer anyway, but it's not useful as doing shit ton of damage as dagger sword. Take the portal so you unlock the rear. Oh yeah, good point. Natural, I'm just gonna take that uh, point over there. Fly, little swan, fly. It could still be like a fun like solo PvP spec, like you know, um when two versus two arena comes out, maybe. Unless of course Gears Gear Great Sword and Dagger can just like one shot me and then of course it's like yeah, okay. For one arena one versus one example, it could be good. Yeah, I was thinking maybe it, But did they say one versus one would came? I think they only said two, three and six. I don't think we're gonna get one versus one. The environment and atmosphere in this game is gorgeous. Yeah, it is. It is really nice. It feels like every zone in this game has been carefully crafted, if you know what I mean. Like, they have really been like thinking about each and zone in this game. If I was you, I would change to something more useful. You're switching to Amazon version anyway. Yeah, so like I could change the deck and, you know, just be like tests it and then on Amazons I can do whatever I, I want over there as well. What about a great sword and a bow? Like how is that? Could that be okay or is that really shit?
I've just seen it on different build websites, Azure, like a real build. Anything can work, just not top tier, I see. For PvP, I can see like great sword bow as something fun, you know, because you can both do like ranger damage and lead damage. What is it I have to do in the last one here? A token for protecting a professional. I mean, if the player base doesn't yield you play join, there's no point. Yeah, like if you have a, like in my case, for example, I always normally play with people in my own guild. Then everyone in the guild can pretty much do what they, what they want. Like play the spec they want. But of course, if I play group finder with a hardcore sweaty people, then of course you would play what is important. Token for protecting a professional. What is this? Oh, wait, there's like a little circle over there. There's like a little bit of a circle over there. Maybe it's inside that one. Where are you going, Natoran? You will be the protector of a uh, NPC. Like that NPC? There's like, a, there's like an NPC here, but I don't know if that's... Oh, there. Then let's go. All right. friend is dying. But yeah, Natura and I see what you're saying. Like, these quests here, this guy here, takes a long time compared to um, what a killing quest would be.
God, my upgrade percent chance right now is horrible. Can I can free new contract take free oh yes I didn't I didn't even think about that You're right coming in in two seconds in that turn Appreciate the tip Oh Arnold, Arnold the Barbarian just followed. I appreciate the follow Arnold the Barbarian. Should I take this one here? Which gives me a epic item. Yeah, no worries, Caden, no worries. I appreciate all the, the low views. Is this one worth taking? Take is it is good. Yeah, because that's like a... Gonna be able to give me like epic armor. Hey Jake, welcome to the stream. Uh, what is the game is this? It's called Throne and Liberty. Oh. No, 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 no. I clicked refresh. <sighs> yep. Yeah. Yeah, because that's like uh, gonna be able to give me like epic armor. Hey Jake, welcome to the stream. Gonna be like epic armor. Hey Jake, welcome to the stream. Uh, what is it called Throne and Lip? Oh, no, 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 no. It's called Throne and Liberty. Oh, no, 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 no. It's called Throne and Liberty. Yeah, we are clipping that because that is just so dumb. Uh, Vito Holt, well, welcome to the stream and good to see you first time chatting. I do this so many times. Yeah, but why is the accept button not like, I mean, you, you see what I'm doing? Like I click here and I click down there because I was like, yeah, and God damn it. Oh, well, uh, what is this? Um, I just want to go level quick. So we're going to just kind of take quests over here in Akudi Aku Valley. Aquity Valley. Aquity Valley. Aquity Valley. Aquity Valley. There we go. All quests with the orcs. I do this so many times. I'm glad I'm not the only one. I had to clip that. Even though I know it's myself doing it, but it's still fun. By to Halls, do you play yourself? I'm just curious. Arnold Bavarian watched a bit. Looks like a game I could spend some fun time in. I definitely think you could. What the hell? It, it's a fun grindy MMO. Like, you always have something to do unless you have really capped out on everything. It's one of those MMOs where you can like, it's easy for you to like, sit down and be like, I should grind this today. I should do this today, you know. After these contracts, I should be max level. So I saw in Diablo 4 that we are soon getting um, Gauntlet, which is that new level 100 dungeon that has like a leaderboard. Is anyone from here going to try that?
It's kind of like a nice duo spec, like when we both believe. Because every time I do damage, it heals Net Torrent, which is a little funny thing. Before Kanoa, before your weapon are at plus nine, take contracts over the weapon stone. Yeah, yeah, and I, I know. Um, uh, Coach was saying exactly the same. The only reason I just picked uh, these was because I wanted to go mid level 50 as fast as possible. So I just picked like random quests for this area. But after this, I will only from now on do uh, weapon quests. Uh, Natural, by the way, I appreciate the help. But when I reach level 50, I'm gonna take a contract break just to look at the new spells I'm gonna get and stuff like that. Like uh, going back to the base and. Uh, D light, you're using NordVPN or Exit Lag? Exit Lag is definitely gonna give you the best um, lat uh, latency in this game. It's also cool that the exit like only, you know, it's not gonna put your entire PC in VPN mode. It's only the program you, you set it to. So me, for example, as a streamer, my OBS doesn't think it's in Korea right now. It's only this game that think it's in Korea. Split tunneling, yeah, couldn't say it better. Bang you. Heal some freaking healing. Boom. Uh, need to go and kill that all fighter. Jeez. And tank. And tank. Can tankerous games gamers? Still doing research over, the, over here. I really hope I'm wrong on this new. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. You had that issue. Sorry. Okay, NordVPN so bad. Got like 600. Yeah, I got 160. 160. You know, 160 with um, exit lag. That's good. That's really good. has to be said that I have a really good internet provider, I have 1000 megabit connection, I have a really strong router, so all my gear is on spot, but exit lag just does such a big difference. Oh, this is not good. This is not good. need two of these fighters. Uh, Cantangerous, I'm about 2 and a MS with Pia? What's Pia? Natural, and by the way guys, you can exit, get exit leg for free USD from Turkey's website. They sell cheaper. I buy from... Oh, really? I didn't know. And they don't like get mad at you, like ban you or something like that. Uh, a token. Oh no. Wait, wait. A token for a nonchalant chef? Uh, Cooks World Dwelling, got Raid Guild. I'll tune up later. Well, thanks for all the. Um, well, thanks for chatting, man. And thanks for following. And thanks for all the help. Appreciate it, man. Have a good uh, guild run. 
They sell mon for annual plans. You you gotta share that website with me uh, off stream. You you definitely have to share me with that, share me that. Yeah, I'll see you, Cox. Um, gather mushrooms, so it's mushroom time. Mushroom time. Mushroom time, mushroom, mushroom, mushroom time. Oh, nice. Are you finished with uh, as much as the main quest you can, Caleb? Or you still got some pieces back? Time to get some sleep. Good night, people. All bumbies, sleep well. Appreciate the, um, the lurk. Thank you so much. I'll, um,. I'll see you around, man. I'll see you around. God damn, I need the mushroom there, but there's way too many orcs here. Can I like fly past them, trick them, and take the mushroom? Oh, that was good. Almost. Okay, so you're probably gonna end up on 49 as well, like me, when you're done with the MSQ. Can't, I can't stop calling it MSQ because of Final Fantasy. There we go. The last one, which is the really bad one, which I should not have picked. Why we have to like get a token. God damn it. Looking at the link you sent me now. 30 days. 170 TL to EKK 38 inch crown. Holy shit. So you, so you just like get a code. You basically just like uh, put into um, the exit like official website. Okay. Yeah, um, that's nice. It's, it kind of reminds me of um, what they used to do with Netflix. I had a, uh, I, I knew someone, well, I know someone who um, does the same with Netflix, where he gets Netflix for like no money, but he can't do that anymore because they have just changed something now, which does you cannot do it, I believe, he said, but he have done it for like many, many, many years. You are running out of the circle. Is that on purpose? I still do for Netflix, huh? Yes. Cannot take contracts before go there. Uh, good point. Uh, but I think I don't need more than this one. I just need. I just wanted to do this one. Get to max level. I think this is going to be enough for me. And then I'm going to not do more contracts. And I'm going to go back to base and uh, think about life. Gucci, welcome to the stream. First time chat, I appreciate it, man. Hey, bro, did you buy that account? Let me know where exactly, if I may ask. Uh, if you can hit me up on... I bought it from G2G. But if you want to have the same person I bought it from, then um, hit me up on Discord and I can send you the link. I don't want to share the link in the Twitch chat since I don't have any agreement with that person. 
Tony, this game looks very good. It, yeah, it's, it's really good. Where the hell is that in PC? Or what? A token for a nonchalant chef. Like, what the hell is that? A nonchalant chef. Should I just abandon this one? Uh, Chris Steele. Welcome to the stream. What's the name of the game? It's uh, Throne of Liberty. Maybe kind of boss. I don't know. Okay, I'm, let's give it 30 seconds more. We're going to search for 30 seconds more. And if we don't find anything, we leave it. Then it's not uh, worth the time. It's a little shift with a wide HP bar you need to find. Yeah, there he is. Alright, thank you. Kiss you, appreciate it. Go to small circle. Yeah, that was what I was trying and it actually worked. Uh, but Gucci. Uh, don't know if you can still hear me, Gucci, but um, if you go to that link, join any of my Discord servers, write to me, and then uh, I'll send you the link. This is it. This is it. Time for me is to hit max level. And I can officially say that I have been max level in this game. And now you die and lose 5% XP? No. What is he doing? He's just running in circles. Hey, Capturo. Welcome, welcome, welcome. Didn't see you on? How dare you? <laughs> uh, no worries, man. No worries. I don't expect you to, uh, to be there on all my streams. They're like, bro, why are you not here? I am so dishonored. <laughs> am I gonna... God damn it. God freaking damn it. I need like one, two more contracts. Oh my god, you're almost level 50. Good job. Yeah, thank you, man. We've been grinding. We've been non-stop grinding now for four hours and 15 minutes. <sighs> okay, we're just gonna do one more contract. Probably two. Let's see. Ba -da -ba -da -ba. Refresh. Just need something in the same area. I like the one over there with the wolves. That was actually pretty fun. What's that place called? Grey Claw Forest? Grey Claw. Let's do the weapon. I know I need the weapons. these epic this time we don't click refresh this time we click accept i want that freaking epic ace man i'm back and it didn't work i don't know what to do uh, that sucks uh what the hell do we do then uh oko kang there's still no amazon release date no sadly no Sadly, no. 
I'm gonna go with that one that gives um, the epic item. Party pin. And Ace, did you ask him? Uh, did you ask him Reddit? Natron, be honest. You have not been grinding all the time. Half the time is speaking and chatting something in the chat. Well, that okay, that's true. I mean, that, that's the thing. Like, if, can you imagine if I played this game and I didn't look in the chat and I just played and just like and just ignored the chat? I don't think uh, you guys would be here. <laughs> I mean, that's how Shroud he normally streams. Just, you know, playing the game, ignoring chat. But you can probably do that when you have 10,000 viewers. But what's the fun in that? You can do one in a 50 zone. It's available now. You can do it in four days to 50 from zero. I... I know someone who did it in two days. Um, he's also like a very like hardcore um, Lost Ark player, but he did it in two days, which I was like, wow. With a group, yeah. Yeah, I don't know what he did. I just know he did it in two days was like, okay. I just all attack you? Oh, you have to defend that. Can't wait to see you trying the dungeons. Oh, you mean the level 50 dungeons? Yeah, it's gonna... and how you like them. Yeah, it's gonna be interesting because, you know, I'm already saying that... Um, Temp Temple of Roar is really hard. So can you imagine, if I say that one is hard, the other one's going to probably be like 10 times harder. Jeez, that came... Hey, we did a guild quest. We just had to kill monsters, I see. So every time someone kills monsters, it progressed. Wait, how did I get here? Hey, epic reward. So I guess when I open that one, it's gonna give me like some kind of like random item. Sure. Didn't see your HP. Well, let's get out of here. We don't have anything to do here. Unless we want to kill that boss. Just chance. Okay. Go, 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 go. all my healing to you. This guy gonna... Oh shit. I need to heal myself. Ah.
Aha, level 50. Now let's get the brick out of here. Congrats, thank you, thank you, thank you. Finally level 50, man. Thanks for the help, Natoran, I appreciate it, man. <laughs> Thank you, Unholy, Kadura, Gizzy, Anad. Appreciate it, Kaelin. And Cantankerous Gamers. That was my last stats, literally my last stat. So I got 30 strength, 30 dexterity, 19 perception. So, oh, we got something uh, a new morph. I got that one. Don't give strength, bro. I don't think it's last stats because I'm level 15 something. Oh, so you get still like XP. I mean, natural. We had some other people come by the stream today, and they said strength was good for damaging because it gives min max damage. And even in that dagger guide I found on website, they also went strength. I don't know. I'm just gonna go with this for now. Okay, let's see what I get in that. Please get me something good. Oh, you can even get that shit. Try it is just 30k Solent. And of course I got shit. Yeah, I'll, I'll refresh my stats when I kind of know more about what I want to go. Because right now I still not 100% sure what I want to go. Because I found out that my weapon combo is kind of shit. Uh, So I, I might try something else. Dex, Wisdom and Rest on them can go Strength. So you go 30 Dex, 30 Wisdom and then you go Rest and Strength. I see. Alright. Back here. Jeets, welcome to the stream, good to see you. What server are English speakers playing on? I saw a lot of people say Casa, but it's not in the server list for me. I mean, as far as I know, I see a lot of English people playing on the server. We are on Astorta, because a lot of like English streamers are playing as well over here. So I guess you could also call it like a bit of a streamer server. But I would say uh, Astorta is a... Uh, the one I hear with a lot of English people play on. I mean, it's very, very rare I see someone with um, a sword here. Yep. Sword. When Europe servers will open, 40% of them will be empty in all servers. They will merge again. Well, and it's, it's better having too many servers than too little and then merge later. Instead of having it, you can you do you remember Lost Ark when that game released? They had way too less, so like they had they didn't add enough servers. That was like a horrible show. That was so horrible with Lost Ark. Can't. 
Cantankerous. Okay, Cantankerous. I see. Um, it's quite interesting. That's kind of I, 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 for fun, I want to try trigger that. I am gonna. I'm gonna play with the, with the destiny now and, and try that. I'm gonna go out of the game, and go into the game and see if it happens. I just did it. I just did it. Well, I mean, I I have to eventually turn off my PC when I log off, you know. <laughs> Let's see. I'm playing. I'm running. I'm running the game again. Running again. Again. Uh, geez, thanks for the info. I'm just starting the game now, so gonna lurk. Yep. Appreciate it, man. Thanks for the lurk. If you got any questions, feel free to ask. Or um, also got like hundred new starter videos on my YouTube doing even more i just need to find like material to record but yeah ask as much as you want in here unhold it's because the cantankerous gamer he had an issue where he went out of the game and back into the game and then it wanted like legal korean name thanks for the response about the account want to clarify where are you from meaning you got the account to play on korean servers and how does this ping feel? I mean, it works. I didn't close purple. I just like, you know, I just closed the game. What do you mean leaving? Oh no, I'm, I'm not I'm unholy. I'm not leaving yet. Not, no, 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 no. Uh, Gucci, thanks for the response about the account. Want to clarify where you're from? Well, I am from Denmark and I bought an account from someone in Korea and I use a VPN to play the game in Korea. And my latency ping right now is 160, which is not bad. I mean, if you play the MMO called Albion Online, I think everyone has 200 ping it forces everyone to have a 200 ping um so it's even better this game on a vpn has even better latency than albion i'd say latency above 220 makes the reaction ability a bit difficult it yeah it does 100 percent g i'm around 140 from australia but you are also theoretically closer to korea than i am in denmark right because i mean distance does something and you buy your account on G2G? Yeah. Yeah. And if you ping me on Discord, I can always um, send you the one I bought it from. Oh, 100 is already too much. Yeah, like when I play World of Warcraft, I have like 30, 30, 15 or something like that. Really good. But yeah, this yeah. We play in Korea, so we just, yeah, I guess, you know, we just have to like take it as it is. Can I play with 200, 230? It's not good, but it's playable. Yeah. Yeah, I'm, I'm actually quite impressed that I'm playing with 167 right now. Um, in When you guys use exit lag, remember to take number six, because that one always have the lowest uh, latency. Number one, two, three is always like really bad. Do you play WoW anymore? I used to watch your WoW videos years ago. Opium Gold, welcome to the stream, man. Good to see you. Um, I I played a lot of WoW when Season Discovery released, like a lot. I played like the entire Season One, and then I kind of like went away. Then you know this game comes came out, and now well, I mean it came out before this game. It's been out like for three months, but I I saw they said that they're stopping banning people, and when I say they stop banning people, I was like, I'm gonna try it. The first ascendant take number three? No, six. Uh, Natron, have a good stream, bro. Need to rest. Well, again, Natron, thank you for running around with me and helping me grind. Appreciate it. 
I mean, you were there and saw me digging, so I appreciate it, man. And I'll see you, um, see another stream. And uh, sleep well. Yehoshia, welcome to the stream on TikTok. What armor is that? So the armor here is called Elite. It's the one called Elite. Um, Elite Resistance, and it's the plate armor. So if I put on the helmet, I look like this. It's just like a blue set that you can craft. It's not like, it's like mainly a tanking, like a tanking uh, defensive build. Uh, because I used to play tank in this game. Dice. Yeah, yeah it's, it's, it's a pretty cool build. Are you playing yourself? Yeah, sure. Uh, Fall, welcome to the stream. Good to see you. First time chat up. From Liberty release date in West. We don't know, but the best we can say is probably Q3. You know, July, August, September. That is so far what it sounds more. When you when you hear about all the rumors, the content creator who has access to some kind of like secret beta right now, all that shit. It sounds like it's going to be Q3. But again, it's only speculations. We have no, nothing that says, you know, what it is. Can tank and rest gamer, the stats are on the gear denote. What class would be weary? The stats are on the gear denote. What class would be wearing it? What do you mean? Can, ta can you explain that a bit to me? So if Helm has strength on it, you probably don't want to wear it if you're staff one. Ah, uh, in that case, yeah, for example, my, my helmet has like health region and believe Asian, which for me screams uh, tank. Because, you know, health regeneration, evasion. It could have also... How did I just get one out of five subs? We didn't get any subs alert. Did someone subscribe? Can you like subscribe on Twitch with silent mode? Like, can you actually click like, so it doesn't like say it in the chat so no one sees it? Well, whoever bought a subscription without making the alert say anything, highly appreciate it, man. Thank you for that. That's strange. I would have think, you know, 40 would say, you know, something like a anonymous person have, you know. So, uh, sorry, was in response on Holy Copy of Life. So, uh, oh, okay. Armor categorized as cloth, light, heavy. Uh, basically, there is... Um, there is when you when you um, when you have your mouse over it. Let me show you quickly. I know you kind of got an answer from over a cantankerous gamer, but let me just show you quickly what kind of different gear there is. Um, you can see this one here, for example, is iron. In the bottom of the item, it says iron. The next one here is leather, and this one here is cloth. So you got cloth, leather, plate. But as um, um, as uh, Cox was saying, Cox Kush was saying earlier, plate gear usually have trades, additional trades you can unlock, which has very defensive stats. Trades, you can see that it's the third one. Well, right now has health region on mine. Those trades you unlock inside iron gear usually is very defensive trades. Where if you are going with something that is litter, it's more like hit crit and crit damage and stuff like that. Dex three normally or something like that. And if you go with something that is cloth, it would usually give you traits like, you know, mana region uh, and so on. 
So yeah, you can still get like some iron items that has like, you know, some DPS stats on randomly, but yeah. Yeah, no worries, man. Um, since the guild hall became level six, we got a new guild skill, we got mana region. I wonder how many max level we have when we would be ready to actually do a like, guild raid. There we go, just as to send uh, the link of who I buy it to. Raid unlocked. Gucci, thank you so much for the follow, man. I appreciate it. Gucci Greek just followed. Thank you, thank you. I appreciate it, man. So we can kill the boss twice with the guild. Okay, then I'm level 49, but I have no energy to level now. No worries. I know that level 49 to 50 is a bit, you know, you have to grind contracts and all that. So um, I highly understand that. Take a good break. And again, Gucci, thank you for the follow, man. Take a good break, Kaylin, and um, okay. So I got new spells: Ascending Slash and Guillotine Blade. What are those? Uh, what did I just throw out? And uh, that was that one. Oh, I have a cup of tea and will sleep soon. And new passive. Oh yeah, new passive slot. That's right. Thank you. So I just got this one on using mobility, move speed, increased mana region by 16 and skill heal by three. This is actually pretty cool. Just by getting like mana region as a DPS. That's not bad. Cannot buy mana and HP potion every day from... Oh, yeah, 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 I heard... That was why I was looking at it. I was like, should I buy something or should I not? I, I did, like, think some, like... There's something I had to remember in here. I appreciate this one. How many coins do I have? Oh, shit, I got a lot. Have we unlocked any cool, like, um, new logos? Oh, yeah, we got some new logos. Got like a skull, lion, under a swain, this thing here. And dead. A snake. Contagoras Gamer level 50 tower time. 
Level 50 tower time. What, what's that? Gate of infinity. What is, what is this gate of infinity? Tails, body collisions, or you can just run through everybody. I think you can, yeah, you can just run through everybody. What are those two spells doing? I need, I need to read up on them. Deals damage equals a 200 tempo base damage, applies collision prone, which has, has a chance to of 80% against bound, sleeping, or stuns target. For area 2 one fine for area hitting. What? Applies collision prone with a chance of 80% against bound, sleeping, or stun target for 2% for area heavy attack, collision prone duration increased by 1. These descriptions sometimes are like. I'm like, what am I reading? Not nice. You should start the main quest because it's is a long one. Oh, I'm gonna do that for next stream. Because, uh, you know, it's almost 1 a.m. over here. My f three kids are gonna wake me up like 6, 7 a.m. So that's gonna be next time. Oh, Snipe, you haven't done the main quest yet? No, well, well I mean, I have up till... Um, I need the last one. The last one that has like 19 steps. I've done all the others. All the others. I just need the level 51. The purely level 51. I was gonna say, that's a good loot along the way. Yeah, and that one is the reason it went so fast. Like, should, when we started the stream today, I was level 44. So that's why I was leveling so fast. So, okay, so this tail tower is some kind of like new thing you can do. Can I do that one or do you only do that? I guess you only can do that one. Left tap. Okay. And then you get one star if you kill him. If you do it in three minutes, you get two. And if you do it in one of three... Let's try. I have no idea what it is. I, I, I guess like a left tap at top screen. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. You mean this one here. But there's only one up to level 45. There's no level 50 boss. It's not easy. You need plus nine weapon. Oh, I see. Okay. If I die in here, do I need... Well, it doesn't matter. Let's just try. And I guess this is just a little trash mob, right? Okay, yep, I just lost half of my HP. Oh, I have to pull it over. Oh, it's the same one as the other scorpion. Oh, I misclicked.
Yeah, I, I do no damage on him. Sagros Gamer, thank you so much for the follow, man. Got a bill, let me know how things go with the author issue. Hopefully, it's just me. Cantankerous Gamers just followed. Appreciate the follow, man. But uh, thanks for joining the stream today, man. Appreciate it. And I'll see you uh, perhaps on another stream. Uh, but yeah, we will see how this authenticate I think goes. It would be a shock if they suddenly, you know, just like ban everyone but um let's see yeah we will see in case i can log in i'm gonna buy hell divers too if i can still log in i will wait with hell divers too <laughs> but um have a good night have a good rest of your day and um, i'll see you another time man don't buy hell divers too i mean it looks so fun it looks so fun it's good, but gets boring fast. I had a feeling that it would get boring fast. I had a feeling it would get boring fast. But it still seems worth for me to, you know, just try it. When is the next uh, castle? Oh, it's tomorrow at 1 p.m. Why on a freaking Sunday? I can't be there 1 p.m. Pick it up on sale and once they added some more content, it needs to build. Yeah, see you, man. See you. Thanks for joining. Thanks for the follow. stuff can everyone just join the siege you can but the only one that is not able to attack you and actually can help you is um, people in your guild or alliance so you know the people in the guild together and the people in if we have any alliances uh, here if we actually had an ally So basically, if, if you join, there will be maybe two to four thousand people who can kill you, and you would be like on your own. So very dangerous, and I'm pretty sure if you die there, you have to pay for the repair bill. Kinda, unless you play, I guess, dagger and you play dagger and go like stealth, Silu. GG level 50? Yeah, man. Yeah. It is so nice. Withdraw, 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 withdraw. Ah, uh, none of this sold. Oh, not enough space. Uh, okay. Um. Great extraction. Silo contracts in top left village is nice. Oh uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. I know that Natrion. He also wanted me to do them once. I'll definitely check them out next time. Oh, where can we sell? Wait, okay, I can just do like dissolve. Ah, come on. Where ends are? Oh, they really have ends over there. You know, you can upgrade inventory space. Can I? Oh, sure. It's 
250. Holy macaroni, that's a lot of gold. I did not know that. I'm not gonna click on that, Kaylin. You just gave me um you just gave me a, a material for a new video. You just gave me uh, materials for no, no video. I'm gonna upgrade it on a video. Um, so can can aware. How many FPS do you have? Um, how? I mean, I don't know, because you have no option in this game to actually toggle it on. But you can see it's pretty smooth. So. Storage is far cheaper. Put materials in. Can I use my materials from storage or do I have to put them in my inventory? Craft material can be used when in storage. Oh my god, that is so good. Thank you for that. I was afraid that it wasn't like Elder Scrolls Online where you, you can do that. But that is so, so good. Okay, then I'm tomorrow. I'm gonna be making a video about inventory space and storage man. Well, basically storage management, where you have the storage and your inventory. Good, 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 good. Uh, where the hell is he? The, oh, oh, on the other side. There we go. So you're saying all these crafting materials here. There we go. So now all my crafting materials is in the bank. recipe I can use for um, a blue dagger Wait, what oh so the recipes has to be in my inventory or what I swear I had a recipe for blue daggers is really weird i i could swear that i had a recipe for crafting blue daggers is there anywhere else i could have put that Trade extraction. I'm tired, I'm off. Have a good night and talk to you later. My friend Valen. Well, Kaylin, thank you so much again for being here on the stream today. I appreciate it. I'll um I'll see you next stream when we're gonna do um perhaps level 50 50 dungeons. That's gonna be uh, that's gonna be dangerous. But uh Kaylin, sleep well, have a good night and uh, I'll see you next time.
I'll see you next time. It is what it is. It is what it is. It is what it is. This solve destroy how to acquire shit chat. Ah. So much to think about. Perhaps I should just go back to Gear's Great Sword and Sword. I wonder how Great Sword and Crossbow would work. Great Sword and Crossbow, would that be weird? Silu at little ears. Yeah, I was thinking like that is probably like really weird. I'm playing now bow dagger and it's better than bow crossbow. I see, so bow dagger is actually like a legit thing. Saya TV, I guess that guy is a streamer as well since his name is um, TV. Saya. Ah, oh, it is. He is a streamer. He streamed 21 hours ago, so he's not live right now. Funny. Wait, what's that? It's time for the end of the year bonus round. We heard of September. That things wants to... No, 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 no. Wait, that doesn't make sense. But that's like a September fit. That's like a December thing. Why is it? Oh, I got gifted a sub on another channel. I see. Hmm. Fair enough. The first descender I'm playing bow dagger. For sure. Silu, yes, dagger gives you a lot of crit and poison damage. I'm mainly using bow. Great sword with daggers good. Yeah, I I have heard great sword with daggers like a meta thing. Um when the game comes to any, I'm gonna play Bow Dagger. Mr. Streamer. Mr. Streamer Dvalin. I'm still unsure, like, I really hope that a like, Great Sword and Wand would somehow work. And I can see how it will kind of work, like a debuff and healing. But it's just so little healing that... I feel like a great sword dagger could still one shot me before any of my healings trigger at all. Maybe I should like a craft. have daggers and tested. I have also seen a lot of I have seen some people saying, you know, there's a longbow, like longbow great sword build. It could also be fun testing that. Great sword longbow. Uh, 
Tasmic. Welcome to stream. Is dagger is dagger warned a viable option? I think no, that's the same issue you have with dagger a uh, great sword wand that your healings is costing too much mana. Your passive healing is healing okay, but it only heals people inside your melee range, which is a bit of a problem. Kizzy, I tried this. It wasn't good damage for me personally. So, okay, so the, the great sword bow is kind of sucky. Like longbow, because yeah, longbow doesn't like really have like the most heavy attacks, does it? I guess like oh my one actually has a level. Um, there we go. Her great sword crossbow is pretty fun. Really. That was the one we just talked about before, which we said was a bit... Well, we kind of said, you know, it would probably be a bit weird. Because I have a blue... I have a blue crossbow. I saw a solo dungeon clear with that build. All right. Yeah, feel free to send the link. Right now I'm just filling in random stuff. Actually, I want to test all the crossbow spells first. Since um, I have played, you know, a lot of great souls, so I already know everything about my um, great souls. So I kind of want to test all the crossbow stuff first. Just gonna find some mobs and play with them. Oh, like a Captura. Good to see you, man. Didn't he say he had to go? Or was that not Captura? No, 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 no. You didn't say. You were just saying goodnight to a Cantagoras gamer. Sorry. gonna leave a like on that video so it saves it in my history solo cursed wasteland attempt great sword crossbow Interesting. Okay. Does he explain about his build or is he more like um, he just plays with it? Oh, I can see the ending. He actually explains it. All right. I'll definitely give it a shot. He shows it in the end. Yeah, I'll, I'll give that a shot. Ah, uh, he actually wiped on the boss. Shame. Is that a hard boss? Like that boss he's fighting right now, is that like a boss you normally have like 10 people on or 20 people? What kind of boss is that? How did you actually send a link in the chat? Oh, it's a six man party. I thought links were turned off. Oh, is that when you are VIP, you can actually send links? Captura, can you try send a link? Just anything, like try Captura, find like any 
any kind of link. Could be anything. Could be a picture of a, a flower. Could be a picture of a cat. Could be. <laughs> well, maybe not anything. Maybe try keep it in for TOS. No, 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 no. Here in the in the Twitch chat because you're not VIP, which I actually should because you have been here many times in the stream. So it's my bad you're not VIP. Um, but before I make you VIP, I just want to see if you can actually link stream like link. Ah, okay. And we, if I make you VIP, Captura sixty eight. Try now. Try link the same thing. I see. Okay, so VIPs. Hey, Nick, good to see you. Well, I mean, you, maybe you've been there the whole time. I saw you at the start. I know we have greeted before, but you know. Okay, so as a VIP, you can send links. As a non VIP. Okay, okay, okay. Uh, yeah, thanks for the Netflix link. I was here, but not during launch. Ah, okay. No, again, no worries, man. Yeah, well, uh, Nick, while you've been away, I've just been um, ding to max level, and now we're gonna try this uh, crossbow build. Uh, not right now, because now it's 1 a.m. It's getting very late, so. How long range do I have? Okay, okay. So let's jump back. That spell reminds me of wild stuff. What was that? I see. Number six. A pressure attack deal bonus damage, base damage. Holy shit. Very interesting. Very interesting. All right. So it is time for me to leave. It's getting very late now. Might Bacon call you hit level 50? I did. I indeed did. Level 50. Very nice. And that was the goal for today's stream. Hit level 50. And the next live stream I can on Monday, which is on Monday. Um, then I can actually do in-game content. Then tomorrow, Sunday, I have like, you know, time to like think about my build, what weapons I want to use and boom, boom, boom. And then Monday, it's going to be all about um, in-game dungeon grinding. And hopefully some people from the guild want to join. Guild or stream. On Holy Cup of Light, those Vistas, Jesus, Vistas. Daggers and LG. Oh, the landscape. Okay, I see. I see what you mean. What Vistas? Because it's the, what they call them in Guild Wars. Daggers and LG. What do you mean, LG? Daggers and longbow. Daggers and longbow. Is that actually a build? It sounds pretty cool. Kind of like a. Uh, uh, like a Robin Hood build, if you know what I mean. 
yeah, using both for reset. I see. I would still like to try the, the great sword and bow. I know people say it's not the best damage, but I still. Dagger bow is really good too. I still really want to try bow and great sword. Yeah, but sadly, you are kind of forced to check which passive sync and stack. Yeah, that has to be a, a lot of research on that. At least when the game releases in um, Europe and NA, we have already done all this research and we know what weapons we're going to be running with and boom, 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 boom. Unless, of course, they release new weapons and we have to like start researching again. All right. I can see the ad break ends in two, one. Everyone should be back now. Oh wait, which reminds me, hold on, who's it? Uh, damn. There we go. Which reminds me that um, I have to why is it over here? There we go. Yeah, but sadly you kind of force me. Snipers here. Yeah. Waiting for axe. Axes would be nice. I really hope we're gonna get like a two-hand axe, but I have a feeling we're only gonna get like um, one-hand axes. Oh, great axe. Yeah, give me that. Great axe and two-hand sword. Yeah. Give me that. And don't make them on your back look, you know, the same, you know, we imagine on the back, we don't want them on the same, like, you know, like the bow and the gray sword is like, they need, don't need to be on top of each other. They have to like cross. That will look insane on the back. They will do, because if you put two great sword on, they cross like this. Yeah. Don't ask me why I, I, I was testing two great swords and it doesn't do anything. It doesn't do anything. It's, it's dumb. But it looked really cool. Exactly, yeah, yeah, yeah. I have to go. I need to leave now because I really have to go to the toilet now. Because I've been sitting here for five hours <laughs> and drinking. So anyone else, anyone, everyone, well, everyone who's watching right now, thank you so much for being here today. It's been a great stream. So many people in the chat. It's been fantastic. So um, I'll see you um, on Monday. You know, Monday, Wednesday, and Saturday, my premier streaming days. Um, so I'll see you on Monday, man. 8 p.m. as usually. So good night, Kissy. Good night, Unholy. Good night, Ketura. Good night, Neek. Do we have any more watching? Night Bacon. Good night, Night Bacon. Night, out, man. See you. Okay, mate. See you. See you. Good night. Bye. Yeah. Sleep well. And I'll see you on uh, Monday if you got the time to come by and help me with some end game. Dungeon grind. I promise you, I'll find out what I'm weapons I'm gonna be playing before man one day. Cool. Peace out. <laughs>